Hello. Hello. Hi. Get that even for fan ready. I'm not gonna play until I get a headache. For those you don't know, we're playing Shipwrecked or Shitwrapped. Um, the game is a horror game. It's got insane amounts of jump scares. To the point where I get so scared that I get a headache and I have to stop and I have to stop playing. <laughs> I can't do it. Shit bricked. Jihad! I thought your name was Jihad. Jihad, thank you for the sub. Thank you for the sub, Jihad! Jihad, my good friend, thank you for the subscription. Uh, Oracle, thank you for the sub. Hello, Thor Dog. Hi! Hello. Jihad is an actual name. I'm sure, I'm sure it's a, I'm sure it's a name, yeah. It's a funny name, and it's also a name. Hello, uh. Akbar. Shipwrecked. Hi, guys. Do you have your Iber friend ready? No, I don't. I'm not taking Iber friend today. I'm chilling. Jump scare adrenaline porn. I see. Why does it, why does it have to be called porn? What is the what what? Welcome all schizo. How high was your blood pressure the last time you had to stop? I didn't measure it. I don't have a blood pressure button. <laughs> El Magatu, I don't have it. Unfortunately. Skissu, thank you for the sub. Baluk, thank you for the sub. Hello, Splosh. Mashallah Albino, as an Arab, I can assure you Hamas will not get home for you today. Mashallah Albino, as an Arab, I can assure you Hamas will not get you for today, Nico Hyper. I would hope not. Hi, Bebo. Hi, Maggots. Guys, chat, you need to rip out the verse of the Quran and read it and pray. I need your energy today. This game is fucking horrible. <laughs> Open! Open the game. This is also a good game. Why is my volume like fucking million? Why is my volume normally? What? What? 35? Nightmare, nightmare, nightmare. Okay. Nightmare. Time for nightmare. I love nightmare. Scatfnaf. <laughs> Scatfnaf. Alright, do it. Okay. Uh. Let's do a little rundown for people who have not watched this game that much. Bobby is a horror game, also known as Shipwrecked. Uh, the premise of the game is that you're playing a a like a, how do you put it? A haunted six, Nintendo 64 game, and there's like people dying. They have been died. They've died. And they they made a game and there was a disaster. It's like FNAF. It's basically FNAF, and then. Uh, uh, yeah, you just go that you just like go through the game and there's like some ARG puzzles like certain buttons you click in the game will open a web page with a YouTube video and the YouTube video will have hints and either the title the description the URL some shit like that and then you uh, figured some more stuff out and you, like you, you, you use that to figure out codes in the game there's different cipher puzzles in the game there's a different there's like this own language in the game you can write called beaver scratch um, and you got different layers so like layer one is here and like the main game Layer two is like uh, a bit further than that. When you start like fail, like if you go, if you fail missions in the base game, you will get put into layer two, and that that's when things get a bit scary. And then you get to layer three, which is the the dark area. That's that's like uh, further beyond level layer two, more spooky. And that's when jump scares start and like things get really fucked up. Layer, uh, we're now at layer four, where it's even worse. Let's go.
I'm in jail. Just kidding. This is the phone. Uh, what was the... That's one button. Uh, basically we're looking at buttons here. This is this button I haven't found yet. Or have I? No. I haven't found this button. But I found this one. This was like it was down there in the corner. So we we, we click this button. Uh I think the last one was in here, in the phone, right? Or so I thought. acclaimed sequel to the Vault and Files, the Boba Files. Bobber. Oh, we got it, we got it, okay. That's all the buttons. We can go back now. <sighs> blood pressure, blood pressure, li I can't speak. Blood pressure rising. There we go. That's what I was, that's what I was gonna say. Thank you, autistic tendencies. Stroke. I just woke today. I was a bit pressed on time. I ha I did the lectures and then I uh, went to the to to climb and then I get home, made dinner, and I did some stuff and then I like did, took a nap and I just woke up from the nap. Just woke up. So yeah, there's that. Whoa. Scary elevator. Uber. What's this door again? Hold up. Here it comes. Appreciating the streams lately since I've got exams next week. They've really been helping me chill during revision. Here it is. Oh. We're good. What that? Another one. They're knocking. Double. I um. Give me a moment, chat. Is Walter coming back? Did you, did you jump? I'm going this way. That's why I did that. We're literally going over here. 
I had to go. I had to do that. My apologies. <laughs> Let's go in here. I gotten caught so many times by the jailers that I don't know the way here other than being tossed into jail. So that's why we're doing it that way. Bat to through. Ah, I have to do the buttons again. Okay. Never mind, they reset when I <sighs> Alright man. Two <laughs> fucking hell. Will we be playing Balato today? Sure. A dog is spawning. That's Walrus, I think. Oh, beep, 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 beep. Becky. Whoa, whoa, stop knocking. Stop the knocking. <sighs> Jump scaring coming. No, it was this way, right? Fuck is this? What was that? Have we seen a, a, like a jail door like this? Yeah. Let's use the comments. Another description. Check the control room for a massive fucking surprise. <laughs> Peter Cogwear. Check the control room for a massive fucking surprise. This game is great. Number 996, very cool. I'm also shocked I made it this far now, throughout all of layer 3. I thought I'd be stuck here and I'd just quit out of fear, and yet here I am, one step closer to hopefully the end. Yo, the last hidden switch was tricky. Bucky, I'm ex I'm accident re really bad uh, acrid -y. Okay. Uh, I'm at the top 150 people who saw this. It says 1,000. This this getting this far in the game only has 1,133 views. This is how this is how many people have made it this far in the game. 1,100, 1,331. That's it. I am number 173. Damn. This was easy, but I'm stupid and forgot about the colored barrels. <laughs> <laughs> Idiot. And a Chinese guy made it too, wow. Bucky. There's a control room over here. Massive fucking surprise. Oh, I don't like this. It's downloading a thing for me. The fuck? I'm scared, dude! 
Macot. What did it download? I don't show you my downloads though. I want to show you what I downloaded. It wasn't called Forest Fuck. I didn't download Forest Fuck. Are you stupid? That's Forest Funk from. Look. Okay, I'm beating the Forest Fuck allegations. It was this one Forest Funk. It was it. It's a good song. Uh, it's true. This again. What? Hold that thought. It downloaded a new version of Shipwreck for me. Shipwreck is for the demo. Okay. Okay, okay. Do we do we launch this? Oh my god. Windows no editor. Okay, I'm gonna put this in a folder and run it. Holy boba zip bomb moment. Whoa, 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 whoa. You're gonna turn the fuck down, bro. One year will need co hyper. What the fuck is this? Whoa! They looked at me. <laughs> this game looks fun, friend. We should play it sometime. Okay. Stop! Ah, I don't want to watch this! Boo. A mouth? It's Paul. <laughs> He's already just getting annoying. He'll simmer down soon. I think. He does that. Oh! 
Oh, wait. Where is it? I can't leave it. Well, I can't. You can't leave the input. Dog. Looks sad. Arab maggot here again. This remittance me when they taught me how to defuse bombs. I was dog stuck, Nico Hyper. <laughs> Thank you for, for the bit, Silmatons. It's so comfortable watching this fucking video. Thank you, game. Or, 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 or. Fuck you, Bucky. Alright. Oh, XO. Nineteen eighty nine. One, two, one, four. Why are you so long? Okay. I don't want to watch more of these, dude. Uh, this is not what I, I... You're not helping me. Yeah! Fucking hell. Ugh. How hungry? Door? It was doors? Can someone clip that?
Green, red, green, red. Eight way three. No, no. Two seven eight one. Thank you, Sivs. Last code. Oh, fuck, wrong game. <laughs> God damn it. How many, chat? How many, guys? You found it. Ah, oh, thank you. Keep going, you're so f too far to quit. Yeah, that that's the only reason I'm playing this fucking game, dude. Don't jump scare me. I love being a gambler. I'm locked in though. I'm locked in though. I'm locked in. I'm. S Bye bye. Go in the barrel, dog. I got a code for this. The first one was just a creepy movie. Got that one. We got that one. Creepy movie. The first one, this one said you, you found it. Congrats. There was, but there's one more keypad I haven't done in this area. But then I can go count the barrels and shit. Uh, how many was what? Uh, door frames? Computers? A little more tables? Than two years. Good luck with this lamps? I'll be yes. I'm assuming there's door frames. Bliet. Bliet. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Or
Why do you look like you're getting your nuts dazed and simultaneously holding in a shit when the spooky ha ha shows up? Spoiler because alert. I Freddy fucked shows your mom. up and uses your ass like a drum in the finale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Very scary indeed. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten! Maybe it's this room? It's just this room, yeah. Okay. So first, it's in the room number one. There's two door frames. Two door frames. Six computers. Tables. One, two, three. Three tables. And then... Lights. One, two, three, four. Four. That's the code. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, one, two. Don't know this game in the slightest. What is? That's a door frame, right? This has to be a door frame. Soul Steve, thank you for the sub. Was this game I'm so confused? It's just puzzles. So we clicked somewhere in the in the game, and it shows a video of this room, the room number one. Uh, how many? And then door frames, computers, tables, lights. Door frames one, two. Tables one, two, three. Computers one, two, three, four, five, six. Lights one, two, three, four. Two six three four. Two six three four should be the code. But it's not. It's not the code. Forty months of suffering, Kuva Boba Jot you clap. Maybe downstairs? It would be weird to the, for this code to apply to somewhere else. Because it seems like it's supposed to be here. One.
I'm not gonna get jump scared. Fuck no. Room 2 has way money, way too money. I can't watch the full thing, can I, now? Could that be something else? It very much looks like a door frame. Two doors. The benches don't look like that, do they? No, this looks like a door frame. It takes a while for it to build up. That should be the code. But uh, yeah, it could be that this is the code for the room downstairs that I haven't gotten yet. hungry right in the video? One. I mean... I guess if you do this, this then sure.
one of those, four of those, three of those, two of those, one, four, two, three. No. So here's like, yeah, one door frame, two tables, uh, one door frame, four computers, two tables, and three lights. So if that was just what you saw in the video, then uh, no. One. Maybe it used to be this specific computer with this screen lit. One, two, three, four. Five, six. No, they all have it. Hmm. Four lights. Two door frames. Take drugs, punch a bear. Thanks. Nine ninety five. Barrel. Fuck you. This is the first floor. Maybe the one is also f the floor. Let's call this input. I don't know. It's, it's it's a room called one. The one room. I'm I'm assuming that you put it in this console here on this keypad. That makes the most sense sense for me. Hint? Go ahead. If you, if you, I, I, I'll take a hint. I'll take a hint. <laughs> Try finger butt all. Thank you. We should count the stuff in the room. <laughs> you guys. Actually retarded. Uh, and your series is still stuck in this place? No, we have we have much more stuff going for us now, but you're counting it right, just not using it correctly. Oh, hello. Uh, and those in this plot is Oh, I heard myself. Shit. Uh, so what? What this is? A video from the code breaker. Yeah. 
Did they beat the plaza? Yeah, this is this is the area directly after the plaza. One. Room one. How many door frames? How many computers? How many tables? How many lights? We know what that is. So what's the problem? Like I I, I counted those things. All of the lights. Oh shit. No 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 no. Go back to being nothing, fuck you. I snapped my coke. You snapped your coke? Uh, yeah, yeah, I so, saw like, I I think it's, uh, that it's, it's but the only thing you can think of, because I 100% I got it correctly, the code is correct, uh, counting correctly, the issue is I made, it, it might be a different code, a place to put in the code. It could be down here, because there's one more area down here I have not input the code. No, it's not the other game, because that's where I found it. I found it in the other game. And there's only one code. This code here. On the wall. With the keys. And the two codes. Was the key. To this getting this info. So. It would then make sense for it to be the code for this one. Where there also is one. Ugh, barrel. Fuck you. More codes on this floor than notes? No. So what's in here then? There's too many computers. Sixteen computers. One light, one door frame. It does not work. This room works because there's like enough to fit with on a single number. It, it can be one, digi one digit. It can't be the room because the number of computer exceeds a single digit. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. Uh oh. Okay. Is it pairing faster? Not really. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight tables.
None of the fight was a mass made of the four men. Three men and one woman, to be exact. They sat in a room waiting for its liberation. That would not come for years. Sixteen eight one. Sixteen eight one one. Fuck you. How does it make seven? How does it make it, 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 the, the door frame is one, so this, it starts with one. It starts with one. So it'll be one, then it'll be sixteen, then it'll be eight. And then we're out of number, so we can't do the light. This can't be it, there's too many. <laughs> 16 equals 1 plus 6 plus 7. Yeah, okay, and what's your point? <laughs> What's your point? <laughs> but it's what sixteen. Sixteen equals one plus six plus seven. Are you stupid? That's not even correct. That's fourteen. It's seven plus seven. It's not seven. It's sixteen. Dude, a chat is actually a, a bunch of dogs. Are you guys brain? Bro. Uh. Six and there's two digits. That's one and six, and there's some is seven. There's no way the game wants me to do that. That's the, that's so stupid. There's no way. That's <laughs> so dumb. That would be really stupid, out of fucking nowhere. Maybe it's only counted out to try to show in the video. I already tried that. I tried that. <laughs> okay. How- Okay, chat, I want you all to be 100% aware of this. It's not for the fucking code breaker. It's not- Say it with me, chat. It's not for the fucking code breaker. It's not for the code breaker, chat. You understand? It's not for the code breaker. It's not for the code breaker. Because there's only one code. The code breaker needs two codes. This in here cannot be a code. Oh, but what if we find another video in the code breaker? It's for the nut breaker. If we find another video in, in this for the second one. Yeah, I guess it could be then. Is the code breaker in the room with us right now? We wouldn't know the the, the what the, it's probably not gonna count computers then. It probably counts table table, and then door frame and something else. But we 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 need to uh, we, we could get a code breaker code here I guess. Yeah. So that's possible. Because you also have a, a room in there with this green green red red so, it could be. 
Because of the green and red room, I think so. Bro. Fuck off. Can't go down. No, this is this down. This is a down. It goes. No more down. I miss old Bino who spends eight hours stream on some puzzle in first Lamilana because he forgot to write single tablet. XD. Next day. One, one, one. Where the fuck I am? The meat corridor. This is the downs he goes. No more downs. Henlo be both. Henlo meet corridor. Christos was kiss. But how can I? I do. Boy, on here? Yes. What? What? What are you? How are you? What 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 what? Okay. Under jail? No, same jail, right? Bobber. Kurva Bobber. Upadla. Zašto? Ja to kvarik sotu i tebe. Hristos oskres. Ding. How do you say that? Christo... Roske? <laughs> How do you write that? Christos? Voskres. I don't know the code of this one. Wait a minute, do I? Jail. There's a dog somewhere here. Oh, I did do this one. This was the number barrels, right? I can't go E. I can't go barrel. I can go in there. Where the fuck is this guy? Oh, 
Christos was kissed. This door. Was that the jail? I think it's the jail. It's the jail. <laughs> Why be in the keep turning that on? Because it's my comfort audio. It makes me calm down. We'll play Blood Royale later today. I beat uh, I beat a couple of decks. But how can I win? I do. Bobber, get off my fucking camera. Bro. There's one right here, right? Yeah, there's one right there. Fat fucking goose. <laughs> now it spawns, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. If it. There's a mechanic to that. If she does that on the side and you're not in the barrel, she will just teleport on you. That's fucking wild. Wow. I never understood this one. It's 1, 2, 3, 4 arranged in many different ways. It says scramble. I don't know which order. The video description? Oh, do you remember the code that Terry gave you? You it like this, you'll need it to, to escape.
4132 So Nine No. Oh, maybe it's the jail code? Seven four one eight. Eight. Eight seven. Motherfucker. Yeah, get me jump screen in the fucking jail, my god. <laughs> Four one two three. Fuck, what, what's that? Uh, three. It's an one four problem. Hello, Walrus. Fuck you. <laughs> Another one. I was already in jail, you dumb fuck. I was already in, I'm already here, what do you want? <laughs> uh, 8714. Ah, okay, so now we, this is open. Okay. Put it, put it, put it. Was that the, the, oh. Yeah, because that's gonna kind of appear out of nowhere though. This could have been the barrel guy. The barrel guy did spawn here one time. It seems very rare. It's behind me. Jotro. Stop it. Oh yeah, I was gonna check uh, the map. What was the control room?
No, pull, 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 pull. I'm a baron. I'm a baron. Not here. Ari, excuse me, get the fuck out of my chat. Get out of my fucking chat. Goodbye. Anyways. <laughs> How? What? what? What do I do? What's the counter to this? What's the counter to it? What is the counter to this? Look at this guy. Hi, hi. Oh, Valbrus also. Very nice. I am, can't wait to leave this area. Pranked. Bucky. <laughs> Fucking fat virus. Sometimes body positivity goes far. Goes too far, I mean. Look at this guy. He needs some body negativity. I'm leaving. Don't mind me. <laughs> Fuck you! This is just silly. <laughs> True, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, Bubba, you want the drop screen? Look, another one. Oh, fuck. Oh, it actually was Boober. You see that? It was first Fat Walrus and then it turned into Boober. Now I go back to jail. Hmm. Eric gets permit for being based, so <laughs> Eric did not get permit, let me assure you. Can you parkour the fuck out of this? Hold up. So I didn't find anything new in here. All I got was more jump scares. Uh, and the code, the input that I thought I had. Uh, was actually something I had. How do, how do, how do I put this? Uh, I, uh, the fucking... <laughs> uh, there was an input code behind the jail that I thought was related to something else, but guys, turns out it was the coral barrels. It was not that at all. So, I gotta figure out how to do the number two room, but I don't have the code for it. I think. Right? No. You can spawn there, I'm leaving, goodbye. The water puzzle is shit, you want a hint? Yeah, go ahead, I can take a little hint. I can take a hint. I feel like I'm understanding it, but yeah. There's nothing to do with for the entire floor, and it is for the code breaker. Damn. Yeah, I assumed it was a code breaker. I, I, so I already assumed it was a code breaker. I know this room. I know the code for this room. That's the first one. I know that it is this combination of buttons. One, one, zero, zero. Okay, we know that. But what the fuck is this then? Because here again, same thing. But I was assuming there was another video for this room. Yeah. 
So... But this is two, so this is obviously the second part of the code. It's not for the code breaker. <laughs> There's 16... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Whoa, what is this barrel? Fuck you. So 16 computers, one door frame, so it's one, and then you have 16, and then you have tables. One, two, three, four, it's eight tables, I know that. Eight, maybe nine, because one is like, yeah, so nine tables, and then one light. So it's one, 16, now we got three digits. One, 16, uh, a nine, and then one. Well, that's five digits, isn't it? One sixteen nine one. One sixteen nine one, like it doesn't work. It don't work though. The answer is barrel. Okay, let me show you guys who has not been around for the past like half hour. What we're doing is this video here. It the video shows you the first room. Wait, how many two? There's one here. It's a video shows you like the uh, the first room, zooms around, number one, first part of the, the eight letter code, and it asks how many, how many door frames, how many computers, how many tables, and how many lights, right? So, in order, door frame, computer, table, light. Okay, so here, in the first room, let me show you. In the first room, that was door frames one, two. The answer is two. Uh, table uh, computers one, two, three, four, five, six. It's six. Tables one, two, three. It's three. Lights one, two, three, four. Four lights. That is a code you can input on the keypad with four digits. However, if you apply the same thing to room two, then you have uh, the problem that there's sixteen computers. Every other thing works, but the computers are sixteen. Now that's why I assumed. That I could go down and find another video to do it for the code breaker that will tell me an another way to create a code in this room. For example, tables and tilted tables. There's a difference. Or benches. How many benches? Or something like that. Uh, but like, uh, yeah, and, and, and there's only one light here. So I was assuming there was a different way of, of doing it. But it could be that there, yeah, there could, that could still be the case. Or it could be that I'm an idiot. What did you just slap to death? Okay. Uh, the, I can show you the lore for it. It's right here. Uh, dwellers. Yeah, it's dwellers. It's a dweller. Dwellers, also known as starlings, are creatures who live in the darkness of layer 3. We're in layer 4 right now. Uh, donning the faces of Bucky's own friends, they will wander around the dark, searching for an unfortunate little beaver who happens to stumble in their path. Awaken when wait, Walter, Giovanni, or Olive are brought down to layer 3, they will stalk around the dark and eventually make their presence known. You cannot rely on your menu to keep you safe. Look for a, a barrel and interact with it to hide away. While dwellers may follow you around in layer 3, that doesn't mean that they won't follow you el elsewhere. Stay alert. You may not be as safe as you think. If a barrel or any objects appear to be off moving or moving, repeatedly hit it until it vanishes. So if you don't do it, then uh, if you don't b hit the barrel, uh, like a dweller will spawn and start chasing you and like jail you. It 
could be the sum of all the rooms, yeah. Sure. But there's still... Well, I guess they all will be two digits? No, if there's sum of all the rooms, then we're missing numbers, because it, the lights is only five. You, then you need more digits, right? Whoa, 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 barrel! Fuck off. <laughs> can you test the gre re green, red? Oh, yeah, I can test the first part of the code. We can go put it in the code breaker. Hold on. So we got a thing called the code breaker, which is a demo of the game. Let me launch that. There are no zeros on the keypad, yeah, right, yeah. <laughs> Almost three years subscribed. What about some feedbacks for the upcoming anniversary? That's Don't tell me now, Tony. I want it to be a surprise. That's a new walling. 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 That's almost my first. If there's a hidden video just for jumping into this pit specifically in the code breaker, I shudder to think how much of things I, like this I missed because I didn't find everything. Hmm. <laughs> nice. Uh, let's do it again. That's a new one. Me when beaver. Same. Better call salt lips recommended. Yeah, I, I was out drinking like uh, a couple of... I think it was last Sunday. Or, or no, Saturday. I went out drinking and I came home with a kebab. And I was like, I don't wanna... I don't wanna sit down and find like a fucking movie to watch. I don't wanna watch anything on YouTube. So I was like, okay, I wanna watch Better Call Saul, but I'm not gonna start watching the entire thing. So I just started watching like salt clips. Like, <laughs> Yeah, I sat for like... I don't know, an hour with the kebab and just watch salt clips on YouTube. Well drunk. It was a good time. Someone's honking outside. No, no, no! Your saving isn't an option. That's okay, we'll just do something else. Lalo. Let's watch the video, guys. Epic cuts in from when I want to do the code breaker. Har har har. Okay, more har har. It was the five bear. All right. That's correct. So, so far it's correct. But I don't know what the other code is. We know the numbers of the things. No. There's one door frame. There's 16 computers. There's nine tables. No.
1691, yeah, that's it. What the fuck is it then? Mix 16 is level. So really? 1, 7. No. 1 door frame. 7 for the computer. 9 tables. 1 light. Fuck up. <laughs> okay. Uh. Yeah, I don't know. Seven, 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 is that it? No, I don't think so. Yeah, like there, there's one door frame. I mean, you can see the door frame down the hall, so it could be two, but I think it's one. It's only one in that room. One door frame. Sixteen computer. Like, it doesn't work. Boba. Eight for the computers. What if you only count the pairs of computers? No, it's not, it's not how we count them. Okay, so the square root of 16 is 4, so the comments are 4 digits. <laughs> Why doesn't Bina get the puzzle? Is he acoustic? I, I don't know. Was there no specific vid for room 2? No, I don't think so. It wraps after 10. Uh, if it does that, that would be very weird. In that case, it would be 1, 6, 9, one. No. I feel like we're overthinking this and the answer is so fucking obvious. It is and it's not the truth. It is and it is not the truth. Is it fucking retard- what? <laughs> Okay, I, I I I don't know how. Uh, so, but just straight up, am I missing a video for room two? No. So I have no idea what the hell is you're supposed to do with room two then.
There's thing you're already rolled two just in plain sight. I mean, it's like it could be 1995. Oh, okay. <laughs> it was literally the year on the fucking poster. That's weird. Uh, yeah, fair enough. It was the name of the poster. It was the number on the poster. All right, here's the here's the video, guys. This is gonna be very comfortable to watch. Trust me. It it only gets better. Oh no. I this you're gonna jump scare me. I know it's gonna jump scare me or some shit. Blot. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, behind this gate lies what could be the start of a bright new tomorrow. I could never bring myself to cut the ribbon on my own. For that, I'll need help from a very special guest. Everyone, put your hands together and make some noise for the one, the only. Light of 17. I think I found the cold, but I feel like I'm gonna get jump scared. There's an eye. Ah! Oh! Long ago, before many of us were born, a man named Rex was brought into the world. Born into a family that was relatively poor, he always strived to create. It was always his dream to become an artist. But up until the 1940s, his cartoons, both animated <gasps> pictures and comics, Duh. were entirely under the Don't do it. It was around then, though, that his first picture, Blot, took off. It was about a rabbit that Rex drew, which then proceeded to leap off the page. Utilizing real photographs of Rex's room, and with Rex himself being a character in the short, a foil to the lack of protagonist, this show ended up selling out immediately as folks were interested in the stunning mix of real life and animation. Rex would produce more films of the same nature, until eventually, he was approached by a company who offered him the deal of a lifetime. Little did he know, this deal led to him selling off his character, as he was so quick to sign on, he didn't read very heavily into what he was signing into. To remedy this, he began to work on a replacement, and that is when Bucky Beaver and his friends were born. Fuck off, Bucky! Of Bucky not only fuck you! Fuck you, Bucky! Get out of my fucking game, Bucky! Suck me. Guys, can someone clip that? What was the code? Bobre Kurva. Fuck you, Bucky, and fuck you, Blot, and fuck you, Givana Goose. 1917 Put, put away your dick, Bucky Fuck you, Bucky Oh my god, bro Oh, there's more The mass of four men sat in the room. It rooted and twitched like a dying animal, but it was still very much alive. It created freedom, liberation, and happiness. Bro. Boop. Kurva, barrel. Fuck you. It shambled, pulling itself out from the room. When it was far enough out of the bu building, it split right in half. The two halves went in their separate ways. Kurva. Yo. I'm gonna click this button. Fish. Fish. Nineteen sixty. 
It begged pleaded to leave, but it was held in that room for a long time. One day though, one checked up upon. The mask was missing. Fish. Whoa. There's a guy on top of there. Whoa, and I see that. No. No. I can't write that. Is there something to the fish? <laughs> I don't know. This is the funniest puzzle to watch someone complete in the game. You're so real for this. I click at the button. What was that button did? JD is so fucking locked locked in. Cogging on from place. Fish. Uh, yeah, okay, but what? Fish.
No, I want the fish clue. It's not gonna fucking... It's not gonna do that. It's not gonna do that, chat. It's not doing it. It's not gonna do it. It's not, it's not doing that. It's not doing that, there's no way. Oh, did I get jump scared? Oh, shit. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I'm used to the game. Uh... Oh shit, how do you do this again? No. So it's not doing that. No. Alright. This is great. Benui. Fish. Whoa. Hi. <laughs> well, bro doesn't even care. Are the numbers on this page? Like... Fish. March 12th. Okay. Is the guy here? Hello. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, he's, he got me. <laughs> Where the hell do I go now? Actually. Oh, we get some back here? Oh. What? Why is this guy here again? It's good to get used to the jump scares. Yeah, I guess. This area is also very like soothing. It's just chill. You're welcome, guys. PNG moment. The area is chill. Does he ever fuck off, I wonder? There's a guy in the ceiling made of 
skin. But yeah, fish. Silence. Instantly, it just starts going off. It's gonna play again. It's gonna play. Oh, can we just have the can we just have the music back? Okay, I figured it out. Thanks to YouTuber Super Horror Bro. Here's the hint. One nine six zero. You just have to use your brain. Yeah. It's fish. Fish. It's a clownfish. It's a, it's a clownfish. So what? Clownfish is this guy. This can't be zeros. Clownfish nineteen sixty. Nemo. If it's like the release date to find a Nemo, like 2003, but there's no zeros, so. It's not that. <laughs> what? What's so funny? I don't get it. Why you, why you Google fish? Clownfish, yeah, clown. Can this fucker go away? He's still here? What the fuck, man? Fucking dog. Birthdays. No, what happened? What happened this day? In 1984. In 1894. Can this guy, like, fuck off. 
Okay. okay. I want to put in the cold, you fucking spastic little dog. My god. Boba the game. Oh, we don't have that. Wait, what was the call for that again, chat? The, the thing spelled out for me, what was it? 1917. Hopefully this guy isn't so annoying anymore. 894. Hmm. What's the first? Is a fish? Blowfish. Wait, someone else only Google this? <laughs> well, fish to... Oh, it's a... It's a... Wait, it's... It's, it's a white. Green, red, blue. Green, green, red, blue. <laughs> Lol. Okay. Nine, nine, eight, three. Wait, wait, wait. What? Doctor Sus. Nine nine eight three. That's what I did, right? The fuck? One, two, no. One nine. I mean, I guess it could be that. No. What is greens? One, two, red, blue. I guess that's... There we go. It didn't open. Nice. No. Okay, you need both. You need both. Now I get to save! As notes from Cogware 1. Where this tunnel leads, you'll know it well. Just promise me you're gonna stay calm. If you go through it, you can open the gate. The world needs to know.
I don't have monsters or everything. Uh, you took the server that starts move. The only one rotting down here. <laughs> so much is left. So much. It's all beyond your understanding. They call out to me. All four of them. I hear their voices teetering around in the inside of my wooden shell. Even down to the pulsating mass laying beneath it. I need you to find me. I won't be easy to catch. You'll need to prove to me that you want what I have. If you do as I ask, you'll know everything. Every single detail of what's happening. Why you are who you are. Let's give it a go. Where are they? Fucking hell! Fucking hell! Fuck you. No you don't. I found two out of ten, where the fuck are the rest? Give on the goose. Maggot McNuggets. Give on the spaghetti and pasta for some. One good side of the second for some. Where's the fucking flesh man? Anyways, what the hell is Boba? Boober. Boober. Boober curva. Hello, goose. <laughs> Goodbye. Uh, give her the ghost. Uh, hello. Very nice. Thank you.
Who is that? Oh! Walrus! Walrus! Fuck off! Get, get off me, dude! You fat fuck! Fat dog! Fat! Walnuts. Fuck off! <laughs> I'm trying to find the the, the 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 voice. Okay. Inshallah, he will go away. No, he's mega fast. Okay, now fuck off. Fuck you. Oh yes, great, more. You don't be goose, don't be goose, don't be goose. Goose is long side. Ah! Man of flesh, you, 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 why you? Only, 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 only. Bucky! It's fucking Bucky! Yo. Yo. Oh, no, he's fast! He's fast! But can you double jump? Haha, <laughs> you can't! What? Okay. Okay, okay. He got me. He got me. He got me. He got me. I knew he was not Latino, so he cannot double jump. But I can. No, I can't. I can't do that. But I can like triple jump and go high. What the fuck is that? I mean, there are so many, so many places I can look. No. What am I? What exactly am I doing here? It's like I, I'm finding them. Okay, but but where the fuck are you? Oh, did I lose one found? No. Damn, bro. I'm be hopping, yeah, fuck it. The ball. Where is this dogs? What is the sound? Hello? Hello, bro. Same place twice. Epic. So they have spawn places and I just have to check them repeatedly. They can spawn in the same place it was just that. That's the, what I'm doing here. I'm just like checking the spawn points and then that dogs will spawn in my fucking face. There is no hull, so I can't check that area. Got him. Yes, good, good. Uh, that I know uh, that's just one position. Good. I spawn, I spawn. Yeah. 
Now jump scare. Because to spawn the dog right over here. Most likely. Yeah. It was Goose. Goose has like long sight. This is slow dog. There's also a fucking beaver. Fuck you, beaver. Might get a goose scare now if he turns around. Yes, mega sight. Did not have ever do that. Hello. Right. Oh, nine. This is a good map. There's like three spawns in here. Oh no! She's gonna jump on me! Oh! Yeah! What now? It's 10! <laughs> oh, it's 11! I'm just that good. Yo. Let's take a look at the little mess you've made. Let's take a look at the mess. I wa I tweeted today. Hi, Kios Mel. Good morning. I think we're reaching the end of this 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 fucking nightmare. That's one of the students I had today, by the way. I'm gonna be honest with you. I've been playing this for about two hours now, and I'm not seeing the widespread appeal you've been promising us. It's, well, to be honest with you, it's clunky. I don't know what I'm doing. The characters who you promised would have depth and life, they are just flat. I thought that's the entire point of a 3D game. What? You oversold it. Goose, that's stop looking at me like that. The company is meant to be stop. new frontiers, and. To be frank, after what happened at Studio Grounds, I really don't think this is going to be anything. It's not going to be anything in the same tier as our movies, our park, anything. And I really hate to say this, because I know for a fact you and your team put a lot of work into this game, but I just, I just don't know if it's worth continuing to sink money into. Sink money into? Mark, this is our job. You've had us working on this for two years, and now suddenly it's an issue? Yes, it's been two years, and in those two years, you've only sat me down now and showed me the actual fucking game. So, what can we do to fix it? No, Lily. This isn't a fix the game issue. It's a fix your perspective issue, Mark. Walter. You are sitting in front of some of the greatest technology of the decade, and you're gonna brush it off? Connor, I'm not brushing anything off. I'm just trying to understand where this... I'm sorry to say, Mark, but it's true. It's not that we've made a bad game. We've all exceeded the industry standard. What we're having a hard time passing is your thick skull and- Connor! Stop. Look, I'm so sorry about him. He's just under a lot of- Is it Harley? Is it not worth it anymore because you're trying to treat her instead? Who's what? the last one? Yeah. I oh, Bobber, Bobber. What, what are you bringing her into this for? Because I bet that's what you're gonna do. You can't keep funding our two years worth of work. Gotta buy her a fancy casket. <laughs> Unbelievable. Mark, look, I- I'm really sorry. Now, uh, Liz, you're fine, okay? But I want you to know that we are done, professionally. All right? I don't want to work with any of you guys again. Quite frankly, I don't want to see you guys touch our property. Any of that. Am I clear? <laughs> For Joshua. Yes, Mark. You can go now. No. No. Because first of all, I want our equipment back. You can go now! You can go! Leave! Take a step closer. Lay a fucking hand on me. You lay one hand on me, I'm gonna make sure you stay in jail for a real long fucking time. Who's the lesson in the background? Who are they gonna believe? You? You are nothing. I will be taking my leave now. Good luck in your future endeavors. I expect the office to be cleared by next week. Do not contact me again. Bunny? William really Afton, har har har, fast blast.
Is that it? Did I beat the game? I think I did. <laughs> it's a GG. Oh, it's Bobber. Go Bobber. Bobber. It's a lovely day today. Why well, <laughs> so sad? Oh my god. <laughs> this is how, how. This is like literally how I walk to work nowadays. <laughs> I'm so fucking tired. Bobber sad. Please just do it. Oh, what? We actually just kill ourselves. <laughs> Thank you, Mark. You're. Oh man. Very nice. <laughs> Just kill yourself. Most energetic part timer in the morning. Oh, what's up? What am I looking at? Enhance! What is that? YouTubers after playing games all day. Connor Thomas has taken his own life. Oh, the guy who was like devlogging and killed himself. As soon as the media found that the disturbing content shipwreck was removed from stores and for nearly two decades has been missing. And you are among the first to see what's inside of it. Among. In other Condor Thomas. You were always there for us as a dad, as a boss. I would not be anywhere without you today, and I missed you. I never stopped missing you since the day we lost you. We hope to bring you your work back out as a good way to pay tribute. We'll miss you, Connor. Patrick Thomas. Fuck you, Walrus. This is based on a true story, Joshua. And Otter, and Goose. Fuck you all. I hate you. And fuck you, Bobber. Playing. Yeah, we beat the game. If he just gives me now, I'm gonna be very mad. Best well, rest well, Connor. Beat the game. Nice. What is this music? I don't know, it sounds like a, like a YouTube video. <laughs> it sounds like, like we're showing some videos on our like presentations at, uh, at the lectures and shit. And they all use, they all use like the most like, hor like stock commission for five dollar ass like tracks in the background. Like royalty free shit. <laughs> that sounds like this. Where did your friends go, Bobber? Yeah, where did they go? Where are they? Where's everyone? <laughs> what the fuck? What's on the head? What happens now? Huh. Now I can go into gallery.
Bucky Beaver, Holly Water, Johnny Goose, Walter Walrus, Sembler Hare, Brandon, Gregory, Olivia, Nathan, Vandal, Blot Rex, The Husk. Bobber. Okay. Is that something else? <laughs> like. Well, we got pictures of them, I guess. What's the role of the husk? I don't know what the role of the husk is. Honestly, no idea. I, I, I didn't really pay too much attention to the story. To me, it's more about, about just like trolling puzzles and doing uh, spooky. Honestly. I'm gonna go take a piss. I Yeah, BRB. I was too scared, because at some point I was in like the plaza, and the plaza ha was the first time I met the dwellers. And that, um, was so spooky that I couldn't focus on reading. <laughs> that's, just, that's it, it was that, that, it's, a, that, it's that simple. It's that simple. <laughs> VRV though. Yeah, I just had to change pants. I shot myself. Should I give this new game plus? Sure. Yeah, no. Twenty twenty three and then ninety seven. Do do. Bingus, I've been really liking your funga videos on YouTube. Cheers, Doc Spin. Look, really, thank you for the sub. So what do you say, buddy? 
Let's go rescue the gang. Let's go rescue the gang. I agreed. Bubber. Yeah, I think the game is finished. Welcome to Super 64 997. Uh, that should be it, no? No. Bubble Blaster doesn't want to kill himself, yeah, <laughs> basically. <laughs> Close in the game. All right. Well, that's 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 uh, that's shipwrecked. Cool, 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 cool game. Very nice. Uh, I d I don't really know what, what what to make of the ending or whatever, but yeah. Nice. I, 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 there might be other endings. I don't know. What now? Uh, we can watch the Elden Ring DLC trailer because I haven't seen it yet. I've been putting it off. I like Elden Ring. They got a new DLC. It's got a trailer. That, yeah. Let's 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 watch let's watch this. Peggy. Let's look at it. He's sixteen. Peggy sixteen. Oh, it is like, it is in the Bikila egg. He wields love to shrive clean the hearts of men. Bikila egg. That's where you enter the DLC then. There is nothing more terrifying. There's the gravestones. There's the developer. <laughs> is the DLC gonna be this big? There's no way. <laughs> How big is this DLC gonna be, chat? How big is this DLC going to be? In that forsaken place, cooling armor. Blood must spill. Oh. What are these, these flowers? Is this is this Trina? Is this Saint Trina stuff? Is this more sleep? It, it looks like they're sleep flowers. Are, are we gonna get sleep Blood weapons? Sleep spells? Spill. I don't know. Blood of Maybe. Hag. They are too painful. Miyazaki said the DLC area is gonna be like the size of Windblade in an interview, I think. Oh, okay, nice. I've heard big. <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> Did it turn like a fucking what? What? What, what is this even? What, what the fuck is this thing? It looks so goofy. It's a walking like cup of flames. Like is it? Is this like a what? Okay. It just looks so stupid. It's cuphead, it, but it looks so dumb. Okay, there's a maggot. Some <laughs> maggot tend to be that sucks you. Nice. There's feet. God bless. And he shoots death blight. Most likely. We're halfway there. Mother, wouldst thou truly lordship sanction? Who the fuck is that? Snake man? Of life. Okay. <laughs> okay, well, you can fucking come around. Whoa, it's the bone fist! It's the fucking bone fist from uh, Dark Souls 2. Like, okay, you got some throwing knives for dogs. And you got a spell that is probably gonna be shit. But yeah, the next is actually bone fist. You do like fucking karate. <laughs> what the fuck? Kung Fu. You can throw balls. Yeah. Okay, you know this thing is gonna be cancer in PvP. This thing is gonna be like actual, like anal cancer to deal with. Just what kind is doing. 
They added a PvP arena. There's a, it's a PvP arena. They added a PvP arena. Fuck off. Actually, just fuck off. Play man. I'll oh, get a grab, that's gonna be fun. Yeah. Nice. I will not be far behind. May we meet again. There already was a PvP. Yeah, they had. Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah, they added a PvP area actually, where you can cube in PvP. Uh, but I forgot it, ex it existed because it was so shit. It was so fucking garbage that I forgot it was a thing. Maybe this like a. Uh, I don't know. What the fuck is this? It looks like PvP for sure. Um, someone asked me, don't I like the PvP of the game? I was like, I do. I do like the PvP of the game, but I don't like 1v1s. I don't like, I don't like, like, Souls PvP in a competitive settings. In a competitive setting. I like Souls PvP when it's isometric. And there's stuff to do, and there's a d dungeon. But if if you're just in the mid, if in a mid open field like this, and it's just you and whoever you're fighting, it's really boring because there are some builds in this game that are just like that just win. Um, but they're they can be more negated if you play around the isometric parts of the game, like having a summon with you, or using the enemies to your advantage, or using the environment to your advantage with like just d dumb shit. You can make it fun. But a uh, uh, competitive Souls PvP is like completely trash. Um, yeah, it's shit. About lines ganking people, I like gank. I like ganking people. I like getting ganked. I think it's all fun. The only thing I don't like is if it's in a mid, if it's like in a flat area. As, as long as it's happening in a in a legacy dungeon and there's things to do there, like in in Dark Souls and in Dark Souls Two, then it's fine. But if it's oh, if it's happening in open oh, so like I guess no I guess my issue with this game is open world PvP. At the end of the day, open world PvP is garbage. Elden Ring PvP would be fun if it's in DS2 setting. Yeah, more or less. If everything is a dungeon, there's and there's always like an, uh, an objective, then yeah, it's fun. But uh, open world is just shit. Oh no, I have to actually fight the person and not chase it. Yes. Yes, it's fucking boring. It's if it's just you and another guy and flat ground, it's really boring. If there's more things to do, if there's it's like it's, if more things can happen and there's like verticality in the stage, you have like a stage to work around, you have traps to work around, you have enemies, you have summons. They, all of this kind of clash together in like something funny. But if it's just like yeah, one v one and like sweaty no estes, like it's just shit. It's just really boring. If you want, if you want that gameplay, then play a, a, a fighting game. Like play Smash, play Tekken, play like Street Fighter or some shit. It it is just not a competitive, and it never has been. The, the 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 PvP of this game is really really basic and not deep at all. There's no thing almost as being good in Souls PvP. Like it's just so it's just so basic and like it's just nothing. You you find you can just find one strat to use and a build to go with it, and you can practically win any situation if it's just if you use the good build um the fun part of the game is just finding a build to use around certain levels uh certain mechanics or, or just like something that works in tandem with the, with like what makes it fun to begin with with which is just like again good stages with verticality like you can wait somewhere and get to jump on someone with like literally a plunging attack you can uh, like push people off cliffs you can you can you can do so many funny things uh, you can hide with like the the mimic uh, like thing and turn it into an object. Um, yeah, there's there's a lot of opportunities in most of the stages, but in the open world, that's just all just eh. The problem is people confusing this game with an actual action game. The combat is base uh, is base as shit, and making the game around the system that they don't deepen is just bad. What? Game around the system that they don't deepen is just. I I know for PVE is fine. It's 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 the, the the combat doesn't have to be so fucking deep or 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 like uh, it doesn't have to be 
uh, super competitive. It just it 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 is already fun, but like people aren't like people nowadays when they play games, they just can't fucking deal with losing. They, they, like people just can't deal with fucking losing. Whenever they lose in a game, it's because something else was wrong, not because you're shit at the game. Like it's always uh, if if I if I get evaded and the invader kills me, oh that's so cheap. Because uh, he had this and this and this and that, and I have brain damage. So it's it's the f- game's fault, and I don't like the game now. And I'm going to give it a negative review and say that it's bad. Uh, and then that hurts sales of the game. That's basically it. I- instead of just uh, like being, okay, I got ganked. Let's see what I can do to fix it next time or be better and not be shit. Like, and, and that's why people are coping so hard about the, the, the asymmetric like, PvP of this game. Where it's like, when, if, if you invade... Granted, invasions are shit in Elden Ring. But if you invade, you e- nowadays you're just gonna get the gank, most likely. You're gonna get... An, a gank is a very strict thing where it, it's literally someone waiting specifically for you in an open field with a pre-made strat to just fuck over invasion. That's a gank. If you invade someone and it just happen to be two people, it's and going through a level, it's not a gank. It's an invasion. Um, most likely you're gonna get a gank. And if you get an invasion... People still, like, even invaders, like, you invade someone willingly, and, they, and then people, like, cry about me being outnumbered in an invasion. Uh, it's fucking insane, because you have the entire stage as your teammate. Like, you, you just don't stop being shit. Um, so that's, yeah, that, that's fine. They are two people, you have the enemies of the stage. Fair. It's just not completely, exactly perfectly balanced. Um... Yeah, it's just, it's just uh, the, the, seeing the discourse, p- seeing people's attitudes to PvP in in Elden Ring, and seeing people's attitudes towards inv- like just just invasions in PvP and all of the shit and like, the things they post online and people uh, people's been in my in my chat, it's always been like I've always been so annoyed over it because people just don't like let themselves enjoy the game. Like you can cry about it all you want, but it's not going to change it. My only, my only grief or like complaint with the game is that uh, uh, invasions can only be against two people. Not because I don't mind having two people against me, but because I just didn't get invasions. My problem was that since it's limited to people co-oping, which is, is the game is going to run out of that eventually, uh, because of that, like, you don't have anyone to invade. And I was, I can't stream the game if I don't get invasions, right? If I, if I stream the game, there needs to be action happening in the game. But that doesn't happen because no one is co-oping. And there's no one to play. No one to invade. I remember half the Elden Ring players or normies who never played the previous games. They will complain about the good parts of PvP. Yeah, but so will people who have played the previous games too. You don't understand this. People who have played Souls games have always been retarded. They did from Dark Souls 1, Dark Souls 2, Dark Souls 3, uh, fucking Sek- even Sekiro, Bloodborne. Every single game, people who play these games have had just like chronic brain damage. And they just can't like understand why the game is the way that it is and they will complain about shit that isn't worth complaining about and they just like be like morons and be obnoxious and annoying i will never forget the one time i was talking to someone about dark souls 1 2 and 3 they insisted that this pvp was better in dark souls 1 and that backstabs were not harder to get in dark souls 2. in dark souls 2 to backstab someone you need to connect an actual attack in their back in dark souls 1 to backstab someone you have to stand behind them for one frame press or one and it's instantly <laughs> backstab but I still had a conversation with some fucking moron back in the day that, and he insisted that it was not the case and that backstabs were balanced in the first game. Like, I will never forget it. I'm still coping about it 10 years later because I, I've always been, like, so annoyed when I talk to people about these fucking games. Like, it, it, it's just, like, you, you lose at the game, just go next. Just fucking go next, man. Like, Jesus Christ. If you want to play Elden Ring, should I play it now or wait for DLC? Uh, if you haven't played it yet, you might as well just wait for DLC, sure, yeah. Although the game is like... <laughs> I, 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 I don't know. I can't make the decision for you, literally. Like, you have... If you if you start Elden Ring now, you are might not even be finished with it when the DLC comes, if you want to do everything. Like, there's so much content in the game, it's fucking unreal. DLC is in June, mind you. By the way, Chad, I'm not going to be playing the DLC on stream when it comes out. Letting you all know now, when this comes out, the 21st of June, I'm getting on a plane to go on vacation. That is very unfortunate, I would love to do it, but when it happens, I'm literally going on vacation. <laughs> so, 
But on the on the on the plus side, chat, you guys get to play the game yourself, or or, or just get familiar with it. And then when I come back from vacation, then you guys can watch me play it. That's gonna be about two weeks later. But I I will play it. Uh, but I I will not play it on release. I'm taking a vacation to play the game on the twenty first. <laughs> Yeah, but I, I am not even home, so I can't play it, even though if I'm on vacation. Do you ever use mods to make new characters for quick VP builds, or do you just use Larval Tears in one character? Larval Tears. Joshua. The backseats will be insane. But you can't backseat, you can't, it, it, I don't care if someone backseats Elden Ring. If someone backseat me playing Elden Ring, then I, I'm just like, okay, well, you're... Well, your suggestion is stupid, and, and you're an idiot. And then that, that, that's that. If someone, but if someone backseats like uh, a good game that I care about, like uh, like Shipwrecked or or La Mulana or a, a, a spoiler sensitive game, then yeah, then that matters. But in Elden Ring, it doesn't matter. It, it's, it's like if someone backseats, I don't care. Millennia incident. What was the millennia incident? Try rolling. Yeah, I, I don't know. Man. But the ultra kill by second. Like, but the ultra kill again was a game I haven't played yet, so that was a like, yeah. And, and the ultra kill was a different kind of backseating where the entire the entire community had like a collective like diagnosis of autism. It was just so fucking weird to play that game on stream. The creature. Cool enemies though. Shadow of the Archery. Is that Mikela, dude? What the fuck? Is Mikela a guy or a girl? Is that Mikela? The snake? The guy. Pre-order to get the in-game bonus gesture, Ring of Mikula. That you get that. You, you pre-order now to get that. Hmm. I don't think I will. Well, maybe I will. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna buy it anyway, so why not just pre-order it? We're getting that anyways. Is this worth the only DLC scheduled? Is this the only DLC scheduled for the ring? So far, yeah. They might do more, they might not do more. Who knows? Physical edition, yeah, yeah, deals. <laughs> it's insane. I love some stuff, but I'm never pre-ordering a game. That, I, yeah, I mean, if it, it, for me, it's just like I'm already, I'm gonna get it anyways. I'm getting it, no matter, no, no matter what, I'll be there. So it, for me, it doesn't matter. <clears throat> I'll be there. I'll be there. Uh, okay. Well, that's that shipwreck's done. Very, very nice game. I had the brain the brain rot on some of the puzzles, but yeah. It was good. It was good. Enjoyed it. What's the next game? Uh, I'll do, I'll do like, we, we can do a poll. We can do a poll. You guys can decide what the, what the game we do next. Uh, what? What game next? Uh, Balatro, poker game. Um, oh, what's the other game I was gonna play? Uh, Signalis was one game, yeah. Do we want to get into that now? I don't know. It's like it's nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So I have like three hours tops. I could do three hours, I guess. But shouldn't I? If I was doing, uh, if I was doing uh, Signalis, shouldn't I like dedicate an entire stream to that? Or like at least a good chunk, more than like three hours. Yeah, so probably not, probably not that now. Probably not that now. I could do it this weekend though. Since we're done with this game. Do 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 do. Mm. 
Void Stranger. Yeah, let's do one of those. I gotta do. I gotta finish one of these games. Have you played Hyperlight Drifter? Yeah. Oh wait, I I got a fucking home. God damn it. Lol. There we go. Okay. Someone asked me about Hyperlight Drifter, and I, I just realized, I just remembered, I was invited to play Hyperlight Breaker. <laughs> but I never replied to the email, so I replied to it now. I forgot to reply to it, but I now I sent reply. So maybe I'll get to play it, I don't know. It was uh, said to be like uh, a little bit ago. Who knows? Who knows? I'm just playing hard to get. I'm just playing hard to get. Don't worry, don't worry about it. Did you get all the achievements in Shipwrecked? No, I don't think so. Shit wrapped. Uh, how many? We're missing... Oh, hi Olivia. Bad ending. Good ending, you escaped. We're missing good ending, bad ending, and hi Olivia. Oh, then that's we got all of it. We got Boo. Seems like Balatro is winning. Two endings, so what did you get? Uh, the last ending seems to be like just one. Uh, I got I got the, the like good ending where you save everyone, but I, get, I didn't get the bad ending where you like make everything go to shit. Uh, Balatro seems to win by a little bit. Then we can play that. Let's play Balatro. I, I, I've, I've really been like enjoying the game lately, so... I'm down to play it. This is a poker game. I love the soundtrack. Here we go. Here we go. Beep, 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 beep. It's a poker rug, like, yeah. I can run you over how it go, how it, um, how it works. We have a... Uh, with black deck. Red stake difficulty. Okay, so we can either try to win with the black deck to unlock a deck. Uh, plus one joker slot, minus one hand every round. So let's have one more joker slot. Uh, but we, we can win with this one. Um, uh, or to unlock a deck, or we could try to win with uh, with like a stake. With like a, dif a difficulty. Red stake. Small blind gives no reward money. Applies to all previous stakes. Right, yeah, so. We can either try that, or we could try the black deck. Let's try black deck. Just to unlock another deck. Girls was blind. Watch through the shop. Seems bad. Okay. The way this game works is that you have a deck of 52 cards. A regular uh, poker deck. Like card deck. And you have hands that you can play. For example. A, uh, a high card. 
has this score of five times one, so you get you get five, and then it adds. Uh, I need a max win. I need a max win. It, it like uh, the the cards you play themselves also have a score. I can show you like in in the in the small blind here. Um, so here we have, for example, I can play queen queen six six. That would be two pairs. Two pairs base score is twenty times two. Um, now this is this is where ten chips, ten chips, six chips, six chips. So this would be. Uh, 32 chips plus 20 times 2. That would be the score. Um, that's basically it. And then you get like modifiers on top of it. Um, now there's a thing here where I, if, I, if I play it, if I play the hand, then I play them and draw new cards. I could also, for example, look for more of these cards and do like... Wait, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. I could also play a straight, I guess. That's 30 times 4. Yeah, that's probably... How, well, how much more is that? That's a whole lot. That's a lot more, I guess. Yeah. Let's play this straight. It adds the card of them and does a time four, so two forty. So now we only need to we need like sixty more to get the uh, to finish this blind. Um, as long as you score t the the blind within the hands you have, you win. Then you get that. Then you win the fight more or less. Um, so here, for example, I could just do two pairs again, like this. And then uh, this is 10 times 2 plus. Wait, that's not a pair. That's two pairs. 20 times 2. Uh, but it's gonna be 20, uh, 40 times 2 plus 9, 9 plus 2. So it's gonna be enough for. Wait, is it gonna be enough? 40 times 2. Well, that's all of the enough, right? Yeah. Yeah, so now we got the blind. Watch for more money. Retrigger each play 2, 3, 4, or 5. That's actually pretty good. Hack. Let's play that. Good. So, if I play a 2, 3, 4, or 5, then it, it uses that card twice. It's, pre it's pretty good. Pretty neat. Here, for example, I'm going to get some extra points for that. Not the best, but it's fine. Minus hands on the black deck is kind of ass, though. We gotta, yeah, th th having hands is pretty good. Hmm. We gotta flush instead. We will. Be, be, Let's try getting some face cards or some shit. Yeah, we did. Alright, two pairs. The black deck gives you another spot for uh, jokers. You're getting no money though, good lord. One or two chance to create a turret card when any. Booster pack is open. Must have room. That's actually pretty nice. Since it's pretty early in the game. We could we could go for this, but temperance is also decent, but not now. Does anyone know the headset brand? I looked for them, but no luck. <laughs> what headset? What happened? To, what headphones are those? Oh, these are uh, Bayer Dynamic DT seventy seventy. These ears are just. Uh, I think they're from Razer. But they are not a part of the headset. They are like put on. So they're two separate things. Also, hi. Uh, do we buy? Uh, I feel like this. I want to make some more money. What's the what's the big blind? The gold. All spade cards are debuffed. All right. I wish a lot of deck you unlock by beating the game with the hardest difficulty. Surely I'll, I'll, I'll yeah. DT seven hundred? No, DT seventy seventy. DT seven seventy. Well, one in two chance to create a uh, tyrant. Ah, that's not really. No, no, that's kind of meh. I'd like a celestial pack though. Straight. 
four of a kind. I think I'll go with three of a kind. It's more it's more like likely to get that. So now I've upgraded my three of a kind to be uh, like a bit higher score. Fifty times five. It's pretty good. Um. Hmm. Pretty good straight. One deep left card though. Um. Yeah, this is not super good. Not what I was hoping for. Whoops. This is a terrible land. Unless... Yeah. We have another number of discards. Wow. Yeah, we don't... That uh, doesn't connect. Just gonna get this off, man. Playing to discard is not usually a nice thing to do, but I can't get three of the same, man. It's just not not possible. Did I have a flush? No, I didn't. We lost. We lose. GG. No. Another one. You're on. Lost with hack? Yeah, hack is not. It doesn't do that much. It's fine. They're only thirty dollars. I think I'd rather do that than buy a three D printer. <laughs> yeah, probably. A voucher now. Foil Joker. All right. Six, eight, eight, nine. Uh. Eh. Man. Horrible hands. I'm just gonna discard lowers then. Fuck it. See how that goes. We got two pairs. Okay, that's fine. And adding the three just to like get rid of that shit. Let's throw it out. Pog. Not the best flush, but it's a flush. Good. This again. Uh, earn five dollars a poker hand is a straight. Oh, this is good to get money. Extra multi final hand around. That's 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 actually not too bad. Three X is really big. But I want to start building money. Let's look for a straight. Get some cash. Let's try getting a six in here. I want to win with the win the straight and get some money. Am I allergic to six? What the fuck? <laughs> How do I not get a six? What the fuck? Jesus Christ. 
Alles, you know what? Alles los, alles los, alles los. Fuck it. Alles truck, alles los. I don't care about money. Alles los. Fuck. I don't care. I want my money. I want my investment to turn out like work out. If, if this game is gonna fuck me like that, I'll, I'll just bend over and get fucked. Whatever. I don't care. I don't care, dude. That's a good skip. Stop with the flush. Nice. And then get another flush. <laughs> okay. Good. You can use ace. Oh, really? I guess I kind of forgot about that. Pimpers is nice. Eight, earn eight dollars if the ha play hand triggers the boss blind ability. What? So if I if I play a diamond card, will I get eight coins? I don't know if that actually works, though. Okay, let's try it. So if I do this, what happens? I only have three hands, though, and I can make 600, so that's kind of... Mm. Oh wow, I actually got 8 from that, holy shit. That's a lot of money. Mm, I do want to get uh, a 10 here. I'm not doing that. How much we're at? We're at four. Oh my god, we're at forty. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Full house. Just this had this guy has so little hands. Like having three hands is so crippling. Holy shit! I gotta make two hundred or so to for the, on the next hand. And now I just have to play some of this. The 9 I discarded could have been a straight, but it's not, so I think it's over now. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Minus one hand is actually so crippling. It's, an, it's actually unreal. The Joker slot is like... Wow. Because, like, we're, we're paying a really big price for... I thought something that doesn't matter until like ante five. Black deck is rough, yeah. Not minus one hand is really really bad. Good lord. Shit's rough, man. Nice, very good. I hate this deck. Just give Joker, just give you Mult and you're fine. <laughs> this is so stupid. I'm just gonna time you up, man. I, I'm, I, 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 the curse of being a roguelike streamer is that people will come into your chat and, just, and say, just get something. It's the most like annoying shit ever. You have no idea. 
Just get something. Fuck off. This is a decent card to have early. So if something is a spade, I just get more points. Get mult, get mult up early, you know. So now we win. If that, we just win. Yeah, so these are like good early game carries, I guess. We won't get the plus handbone route though. This is this is really sad. Spade and I will win. That should win. Made it 22, boys. Mm. My god. Unreal. One more discard is nice. Mega pack. Do we go for that? Mega pack is worth like eight, so we get eight coins. Do we play and get some coins instead? We get interest now, which is nice. I want the interest. I need jokers. Yeah. Can I draw a single blade? Thank you. Jesus Christ. I need to look at shops and I need to, like, just get shit. Add one self-value to every joker and consumable card at the end of round. That's nice. Another joker card? Yeah, let's go, go get that. Play physical wants just to give two dollars. Oh, that, there we go. The planet card, a played card, contains two or more eights. Gains three of a cell value at the end of the round. Earn five dollars if if three or more faced cards are discarded at the same time. This will get a lot of cell value. I mean, if we if we get the knife later, if we find the if we find the knife later, this is gonna be really big money. That's funny. Kind of allergic to spades, really. Should be able to just still outward win with this because of uh, this card. Yeah, this thing is just really strong. Flushing with one of these is just carries you the first two antis. Which I like. The first hand around this single six, destroy it and create a spectral card. Must have room. Uh, seems good. Spectral cards are pretty powerful, right? Another Discord is actually since we're doing this, another Discord would be very nice. I'm gonna get the Discord. I want that. Increase level played poker on, okay. I have a flush here, I guess. I mean, I could play it, but... But it's not gonna be worth shit without spades. That's the problem. Oh, 
hard it is to get the fucking spade, Jesus Christ. I win. All cards are considered face cards. What? Play face cards have a chance. To, one of the chance to make money when scored. All chances are considered face cards. What the fuck? Okay, we're gonna be making mad fucking bank though. <laughs> Wow, that's actually crazy. Double money. Create plates for these cards. Yeah, we gotta we gotta go for that. Double money again. No, we won't put it on spades. Uh, if, I if I survive the next uh, couple of rounds, I'll make mad money. It also comes out to drawing my fucking spades. So. Wow. First level zero. Why? Did it deliver my, my flush? There's no way. Permanently? Wow, dude. That's so scuffed. I need to find Jupiter, but I can't find it. That's the problem. Seriously? Oh my god. My flush is terrible now. I don't know why I'm still allergic to spades. Cannot get a single like pair or something? What's going on here? Thank you. Full is still level one though, but look at all the fucking money, holy shit. I don't think I'm gonna make this though because I don't, I'm not like making scoring enough. Like it's not. It's not. What's well, positive? Yeah, it's actually over. It's over. Still win, but the boss is gonna fuck us though. We're, we're really rich. We just got a lot of money. But does that help? I could make another Joker, I guess. I can create two tarot cards. I think I'll do that. 
I lost me more money. I have 100 gold, boys. Double money, 20. Steel card. Okay, flush is low a bit higher. Polychrome. One X one point five X melt, which is nice. Well, now it's over, most or more or less, right? Because I can't use my spades. That's the only reason I'm getting any scores, my sp spades, so... I didn't- I got, like, a money scaling, but I couldn't find a, a way to, like... And, and we got the spade boss, it's just like... Yeah, but it's over. Like, it's just over. Your all cards are faces and rolled over 30 tokens per face. Yikes. Five thousand six is not that much, but like, and we have some uh, two pairs level four, for example. So it will make some, but it's, it's a debuffed card, so it's like, eh, it's not that good anymore. One thousand from that, yeah. Will I make enough to make it, like, to finish this? Two pairs is the strongest hand that I have. Had to go all in for that, but it didn't work out. I have more discards, so I have a lot of more discards, fine. I don't mind. We have two aces, but one is debuffed, so that's gonna ass. Okay, that was the last card with Queen, Queen, 9-9. Nine, nine. Is this work? And the, the buffs card is like... <laughs> No, that, that, that was just, I, that, just, that just fucked me. That just actually fucked me. The, this, the even if the spade, when the spade is my only good thing, then no. It doesn't work. Can't do that. Mega Arcana, Holographic Joker. Plus the bolt. Ah. Uh, two turrets for a skip? I don't know. I, 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 I'm gonna start making money. You want to get money to get jokers, yeah. yeah. On this character, you kind of need to get joker. The jokers in place because like that's your entire strength. Like that is it, man. Give me the queen, man. Thank you. Mm. 
So we got high roller. Oh shit, Gekler, thank you for the uh, congrats. Where's the high roller, dude? Create tarot card if hand is played with three dollars or less. Plus the strength, straight. I mean, if we have no money, then we can just give, make tarot cards. That's good, no? <clears throat> but you need money to make money. That's true. There was no sound alert. I don't know why it didn't work. I, I, I really don't. Couldn't tell you. Sorry about that. You can't sell them, yeah. It's gonna create at least two turrets, but after that... We're gonna have to stay broke for a while. I'll try it out. Last card, like, yeah. Yeah. Strong. It's like, yeah, we got some, we got some tires now, but like. This isn't, uh, I can't really do that. Full house, I guess. We could do that, but. It's kind of an inconsistent thing to get. It's kind of hard to get. Boomer and I and Nico Hyper. I'm trying to like this. Three. Wild card. I like wild cards. Let's use it. Okay. Look at that, four of a kind. God, what the fucking damn. I hate the gold. The gold can fuck right off. Magician. <clears throat> Create turrets. I love turrets, I guess. Club, did we, did we go for a club joker again? Surely this will not backfire. Surely this will not backfire. No, it would never. Foil joker. I'll play. Make a lucky king or lucky ace. My lucky club ace. Because we like clubs right now. We like clubs. But let's make a lucky, lucky club. What? What? Dog! I was gonna use the card! My god, okay, spade ace. Oh my god. Nope. Oh my god, dude. Unreal, dude. Chariot, steel card, that's so bad. Like, it, it, this, this, uh, their cannons are like mega dog shit. They're trash. Tarot. 
Tarot's are the best card. No, they're not. They're really not. They ain't. <laughs> Why would it? Why would it? Planet of Hell. Uh, I like the wild card. Uh, yeah, sure, I'll take that. This is this one is like zero potential. It's like negative one potential. But I'll I'll roll with it. Is this real? Chat, is this real? <laughs> That's all my Discord. <laughs> what the fuck's happening? Jesus Christ man. Discover every tarot card. Oh, very nice. The world. Cool. We can go in debt now. That actually is nice. Yeah, let's buy that. That's uh, there's nice synergy with these two. Let's go in debt. <laughs> oh, bum. Uh, really? That's actually really good. Debt gaming. Lucky card. Mega pack. What do we have here? Double your money. Of, yeah. Nope. Love it. I mean, I don't want to. Do, I don't want to do like a gold. I, I guess a gold card isn't isn't really that good. So I'll just try this. Yeah, plus zero. <laughs> I don't know what I expected, man. One and seven run face down. That's very sad. What do you mean? They're, they're, they're in the same Why are they not? What? Dog? My god. Oh, we got a wild card, never mind. Lovers. Wild card. Nice. Interest does not really work with this, but we're going. Yeah, no. Gains multiple. I've a lucky card successfully, successfully triggers. But that's like. it's It never fucking triggers, though. Chips is three of a kind. Surely. 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 We have some, but. Four of a kind. Uh, two pairs is much more likely to happen. I never get four of a kind. Fifteen. Gold. What's the boss again? All club cards, wait. It doesn't fail. It doesn't fail. It actually doesn't fail, dude. I go for that carry so that it can like life support my fucking run and I get clubs are debuffed every time. The same if I do heart, it's heart is debuffed. It's, it, whatever I do, it's always that. It's fucking hell, dude. Good lord. Nice. One shot for, so we get one more coin. That's nice. We get five instead of trash. This one is awful. Forex multi every six hand played. No. I'm the I'm one king, so then we win. Do you want king? Jesus Christ, can I just have the king? I will get the king. This is fine, I will get the king. Okay. 
fucking hell. Oh, that's so shit. Oh my god. Wait, did I lose? <laughs> Did I actually lose? Wait. Wow, okay, well, new game. Very nice, dude. Yeah, but black black is just so black is so shit. Black deck is actually fucking trash, dude. The, the one hand loss is like for one hand lost, what does it mean, chat? It means that I have one less has to win the game. It also means that I get one less coin every fucking round. It's so ass. And you get one Joker slot, like who cares? It's mega shit. Nice. One shot. Real to two less, that's complete ass. Uh, first blade face card gives two X. Uh, first blade, eh. Create two common jokers. Okay, yeah, th there we go. Okay, when blind selected, create jokers. Okay, cool. Common jokers. Polychrome. No, I won't play. Oh, we got 10 and 4! And we got... 5 dollars and 3 armors. Face cards are discarded. That's so nice. This is really good. The walkie talk is epic. 10 and 4 gaming. This is a carry. This is an early game carry. And it doesn't rely on swords. So that's very nice. I get money. This is actually just win, right? Yeah. Super good. Mm. Negative. Plus for the mult. Uh, plus mult. It costs 10, though. So, okay. It gets 20 plus mult now, but then later it will go down. However. We don't care because the negatives, main negative jokers are jokers that are good in the long run. This is not good in the long run, so this is bait. Ten, ten dollar bait, it sucks. This is also bait, it sucks. I don't need anything, I'll just keep interest and fuck off. Must play this high card, that's fine. Two more jokers. Add double the rank of the lower card, yeah, okay. Uh, play aces, keep first. yeah, okay, aces are good. Okay. Money. Win. Get the interest based. The voucher is shit. This one's nice for money. Yeah. Gonna sell them. Keep rolling those and just get, get generate interest. Um, yeah, these are ass. No, we can get a standard pack or a jumbo. Get to do both. Straight flush right now. Three of a kind is fine. You can pretty consistently get that. Another 10? It's a golden 10. Eh, it's a 10 though. Foil Joker. Banana. Plus from Okay, those are fine. Get some money first. Fillers doesn't matter. 
Because what we're going for here is, is I want to like, farm money with this thing. Five dollars. We get five dollars per time I do that, which is really good. Did I still get the same? Did I get? Did I ever get the same voucher twice? There's no way. Oh my god, dude. No fucking way, dude. Unreal. I don't negative. A negative is around the Joker. Minus one hand size. Hand size is pretty bad to lose. I don't like that. No, we already have one Joker slot, so no. Virtual to one suit is not really helpful. That's all. I'm. I'm no. Oh. 10 with 10? Oh my god. Reach for red suit is very good, but a 10 with uh oh good. yeah. Oh. Where's my tens and fours? I don't. I can't. I have like so many, but I haven't. I have only drawn one of them. What the fuck? What? Where are they? I'm going. I'm just gonna go for a gambler. Okay, I lived, but like, Jesus Christ, man. Mm. Fucking hell. Level of three of a kind, that's kinda nice. I have six Joker slots, right? I forgot about that. My bad. Crazy, okay. Multiple card. We could uh, add multiplier to ten and. Uh, there's no four here, though. Hmm. Popcorn is here. Okay. Hard cards are the that should be a not to give it them. Give for chips if play hand has exactly four cards. Currently 16. Right. There we go. I, just, I don't know why I'm like incapable of drawing my fucking cards, dude. I really don't get it. What? What? How did I win that? <laughs> what happened? Oh, was it popcorn? Actually, you have a kind Willy Joker. I mean, it kind of works, I guess, but. Mm -hmm. Mm 
Uh, we could make a 9 into a 10. That's one thing we could do. That's fine. Okay, we're going. I feel like it's best to just go for one of them and just, yeah, take it from there. Each card counts on scoring, that's nice, I guess. And has two select cards into bonus cards, more chips, yeah. Yeah, okay. I'm not gonna reel more than that. Rare Joker. A rare Joker would be nice to have, though, but we get two. Yeah. I want to look at more shops instead, yeah. This is. We already have that. They have already seen this, right? Okay. Money. No, it's actually, if I don't play the three there, I, yeah, it's actually more. <laughs> wow. Yeah. If it was to restock, right. Extra multi if they play Pokemon has been already played this run. That could actually be, that could actually work, I guess. This could definitely work. Gold card. I mean, uh, okay. Sure. Fucking yeah. Double money is fine, I guess. Uh, this is only twenty coins. I guess it's fine. Foil multicolors. Uh, it's it. I, it this thing never works. So that's the thing. It just never works. So I'm gonna do it. Tell me about some cards. I don't make my cards. Useless, useless. Oh well. Mega Buffoon Pack. No, I can just get two good gifts, sorry. Uh huh. Here we go. I'm allergic to the cards that I like to play. Truly. We'll draw it next turn, trust me. Okay. Oh. Got some cash. Uh, three or four cars. Yeah, uh, well, this this kind of works, I guess. Eight multi is still fine. Ten. Not ten. Ten. 
Foil gold. Not him. Played cards with club give plus four. Yeah, so that, 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 that I, I mean. I forgot to use this run. It's kind of a really slow scaling thing. All flush and switch can be the four cards. That's actually really, wow. That's pretty good. One more reroll. Well. Wish me luck. Play only one hand. Oh. Okay. My favorite. We have to make 2008 in this. I think we gotta do it to tens, right? I have some tens in my deck, so surely I will draw a ten with this. I did. Okay, very good. Well, we hit eight. Good. And the forest here, boys. Consumable slot. Plus, plus one discard, that's that's a good one. Yeah. Take that. Oh, force. Retrigger this card one time, that's actually very nice. Goal is good, but a retrigger is pretty epic. Not three of a kind. Alright then. The dagger is here. That's a pretty good, uh, yeah, actually that's a pretty good synergy with uh, this and the... Uh, yeah. We have six or six slots, so we gotta make some, some at least one open, but once we gotta have one more slot. Double Shimani? Oh wow. Six multiplier now. I'm relying so hard on the fucking find the uh, three of a kind that if I don't find it, I think it's got the four by accident. It is problem. Push button. Yeah, there's a stack. Okay. Here's another sub for you. Happy to watch your stream and be entertained by your brain rot, dog. Thank you. Not ten. Good guy. This card is nice. Uh, did we, we could just... Did we just take, make a riffraff fuck off them? It doesn't do anything on its own, so we could just say fuck off. We could also scale red card, I guess. But it's not it's not that much. Hmm. 
Look at this one. I love this one rounds. Lives. We get some money. Get some interest. Bad. Uh, extra multiplayer is secretly hand played without using your most played poke. Okay, that's terrible. That's like the anti of the game. Because you want to just focus on one hand. Because you can't like upgrade everything. You want to focus on one thing and like <laughs> this thing is awful. We can sacrifice it yeah, for some good multiplayer on this, sure. Trace with turrets or just get some money? We can get we get eleven coins right now. That'll make some. We got tempers anyways, and we got this which is useless. Nice. Four seven, that's fine. Fifteen coins. Sell. I guess I'll take that. I mean, I have the money for it, so why not? First time, just throw face down. Face down. Okay, that's not great, but. Didn't hit. Didn't hit. Last try. I don't know if it's gonna be enough. It was enough. Good. Vinda really lucky with the draw orders and shit. Minus one anti. Okay, so we we, we beat uh, four. So believers win. Minus one hand? Oh, that's really bad though. Oof. Bad long term, but. Yeah. Minus one hand is terrible. Sell. Good. Okay. Eighteen minutes on that is pretty good. Earned four dollars in the round. Plus one. Clubbed. One for euro per shop. I think the form or form world isn't that much anymore, right? Played cards with ten. Mm, no. Hieroglyph. Minus one. Oh, I can't do minus one hand. This doesn't work. Doesn't work. I, can't, I haven't thrown a single 10. What's the, what is going on here? Where, where's my cards? What is going on? Thank you. Jesus Christ.
Nu är gabbel right, vi kan dö med nu är gabbel sure. Nej, inte alls. Polygram, 1.5 mörkt. Kars, plubbet, spid. Okej, det är fint, jag tror. Skadet queen. Ja, och det är också 1.5 mörkt. Så det är gott. Although, it's, having it after the knife is kind of awkward, because it... Uh, well, it can just be arranged, I'm sure, yeah. Surely I won't forget. Multiple cards. Oh, this is fine. Little turn. That's good. One more turn. Good. The scaling of this is not very good, yeah, so 10 chips and 4 mush. I guess this is, I, th I think we should probably stop focusing on this now. Maybe. This is not doing that much anymore. Negative Joker is kind of nice though. Wanna get a negative Joker? I think we wanna get a negative Joker actually. Very sad. But I just got a good hand, so we're chilling. We win. No, oh, I should have arranged it. Yeah, sorry about that. Whoops, whoops, whoopsie. Uh, negative. Earn four dollars at the end of the round. I, I, I made sure. It's, it's, it will pay out in a long time, but yeah. That's great. Ten. Almost there. Play more force. That should be it. Yeah, we're still not getting like that much uh, score, but whatever. Two extra multiple to flush. Uh, enhance the multi cards. I still haven't found the fucking thing that gives gives me like um, that gives me uh, like it enhances the numbers of the cards. But I guess this is f this could work though. If I if I add, add four multi to the cards as well, that would be nice. Yeah. Order. The bit money. Turns to ah, we can make another ten here, I guess. Oh, I could double money. Double money. Flush. Even Steven. Well, even Steven helps. Uh, f plus four mult. Ah, ah, but it's just like fl it's just mult. Extra mult have played Pokemon has all of this been played this round. That's that's a lot. That's a lot of. This is like if I if I do one uh like three three of a kind and another one like yeah that's really good. Three X is insane. Very nice.
that's like what I was looking for. Polychrome is 1.5 mult, but I don't really. I mean, I could, but. One point five mult. Because at some point you wanna. Well, I'd like to discard. Ten four is nice. Spade is nice. Yeah, whatever. Now it'll be uh, like a fuck ton. Yeah, 69k or something that. Also, if I, if I use this to discard cards, then it, yeah, that kind of fucks up. Hmm. Yeah, the half joker is kind of scuffed. Because it's only if I play with three or fewer cards, which might not always be the case. I might want to play more to just like discard them. Plus one is nice. I'll sacrifice that one. I want to start getting more multiplayer on this, actually. Sad. Put the retrigger one, right? What the foil one? Plus one chase, plus not. I think I want to retrigger. That should do it. There we go. Good. Some money. This is such a shit voucher. You, you could get an extra hand here. You could get an extra, like, discard here. You could get, like, an extra hand size here. But no, tarot cards appear more frequently. Like, why the fuck would I care about that? You stupid? What a joke. Uh, yeah, this is surely not worth it, right? Tarot cards appear more often, like, for $10? No, fuck no. What's the tag? What's the, I don't know what the tag is. I forgot to do that. Oops. Good. Mm. 
Uh, Retrieve all played cards on final hand of round. That's that's pretty good. I can see that being uh, good. Playing three of a kind since one to zero. <laughs> what, what, dude, I swear to god, I always get fucked by some stupid shit like that. What the fuck? That's fine though. Didn't get well in the edit. Skip. Alright, man. Every play card get permanently against four ships when scored. Take the hiker. Retrigger all. Yeah, retrigger all cards is sh surely better. One point five multi. I can't sell. I can't take, take that away. Uh, this is good though. I, but I want to feed feed the knife something. I need a discard. I can't give up the discard. There's no way. It's so important. Because I only have three hands, so I need to be able to discard. But I can see this one being like a really, really important fucking thing. But the discard could really just help me get the, the, X, the, the 10 that I need to get a 3 of a kind. Mono Joker is negative, so it doesn't matter. He doesn't take a slot. Did Chai carry into seven? Yeah, I know, but I, I wanted like I kind of want to just like um, feed the this something. So if I could trim one more often, that would be great. But I think it can. I guess I'll just eat the hiker then. Sell this card to disable the current boss blind. Whoa! Well, that seems pretty good, isn't it? That's a lot of money. Uh, Mulch for every blind skip. It's a bit late for it, but I'm gonna add a sacrifice for the dagger. Forget. Yeah, forget. Just watched your entire La Mulana 2 playthrough over the last two days. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Three of a kind go. Relax. Bonus cards.
Yeah, we're gonna fl finish Blunky one. I think I beat the game, but I didn't do like the, the fully, full like, yeah. The entire thing, I guess. Can we uh, get the thing that I want? No. Can we get the thing that I want? Seriously? <laughs> what the fuck's wrong with this game? Seems like he's still there. Not that I care too much, but... Thank you! Yeah, minus 18. Here comes the big one. There we go. I thought I sold the thing for it, but I, I still like a ten coins, so it's like it's we're chilling, I guess. Uh, if we skip, Jupiter is here. Jumbo Celestial Pack, Arcana Pack. Last anti now. We got nine here. Full house, yeah, that's awful. That's it. One more 10 in the deck, in the deck, and one less other card. That's pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, we can buy a 4 card and just sacrifice it for the knife. Call it today. Mega Arcana pack, I don't really care too much. Oh! Very nice. We would like to find a 9 here. Or for 3. Good. 4-4. Four, four. Very nice. Very large blind, yeah. I don't know if we're gonna be able to make 300k in, in that, not that many hands. Actually, I don't know. One hundred chips if it's three of a kind. That's actually, you know what? I'll buy it and keep it. That's actually fine. Inshallah, it will be the one that I need. It will be three of a kind. God, thank you so much. No, what's Noah? Add the number of times poker hand has been played in Bolt. Oh, wait, so three of a kind. How much is that? 25. 25 Bolt. One hundred chips chips for 25 Bolt. Yeah, we have a multiplier on the, on the end of the 3x. It's a lot more chips, but I guess, yeah. I don't have money for it? Wait, I don't have money for it, shit. Well, I guess it's a view. There we go. I don't need the money joker anymore. Even though it's negative, it doesn't matter. Just need the money. We'll look for more shop, I guess. Do 
26 multi, yeah. Look at that. And it keeps growing. A, a little bit. Not much, but it keeps growing. Wow. There we go. That's more like it. Five coins, dude. Uh, I guess, yeah. We unlocked Copus of Ability of Joker. Copus Ability. Oh, that's what it is. Some of them is so good. Copus Ability of the Joker is right. Wow. If I could have got that now, holy shit. I can actually if I sell one thing. We can get Card Sharp twice. That's really good. Sell Supernova or something else, and then just like. We could sell the Walkie Talkie even. You guys really don't like this card? Dagger is 46 mult. Uh, the, the, the spades is 1.5 mult. Which is fine, but I guess it, we get 1.5 more if we copy this. Dagger would not be, we don't want to sell for 46 much, that's not gonna happen. Uh, Drunkard, it could be sold, or Walk, it could also be sold because it's plus 4, plus 10. It's not that much anymore. This is honestly not that much anymore. So if in a tree of a kind, uh, each play 10 or 4 gives 10 chips and 4 mulch. So. 10 ships, 4 mult, times 3. Ships are really important, yeah, kind of are. I think it's, it's just selling Supernova, it, it, like, it, it, it will always go in plus if you sell for Supernova, because Supernova is like, you can copy the dagger, which means that it will, uh, like, if you copy the dagger, it's 46 mult, which is more than whatever this is, because this is uh, now 27. So all the day it's better if you copy the dagger. And then if it copies this, when we have already played at three of a kind, it's gonna be X6. So like, yeah, we sell Supernova. And it can give you another discard even. That's pretty good. Oh, I kept that one though. <laughs> So we start with, uh, with taking the bolt. There we go. So first we play the 4-4. Four, four. Oh, we only have two. F okay, we don't have them. It's the first to copy the dagger from more, from more multiplayer. Now we copy the, this one here for more uh, multiplayer multiplayer. Yeah, <laughs> we, we got it. There we go. All right, we win. Blueprint uh, really did a did a fucking number there. Holy, very nice. Black deck is fucking terrible though. Never playing that deck again. The, the minus one hand is is so detrimental. Like it's unreal. Yes. Nice. Start run with twenty six spades and twenty six hearts in deck. Wow. Checkerboard deck. The flush is gonna be very. That's a very special deck. What the fuck? Yes, I've beaten the game with red, blue, yellow, green, black, and now we're into magic, nebula, ghost, abandoned, checkered. Uh, red stake, green stake, black stake, blue stake, and then orange stake. Okay. X1327, by the way. Yeah, that, that's, that's the scaling of this game, man. This is how it goes. That's how it goes, man. And I'm not going to play endless mode. 
That seems like a waste of time. Wall two, we need to gamble. I left our, our star stack for the one. You got so lucky. I didn't say so. That's like uh, it's just how it has to go, more or less. If you want to do it, like it, yeah. I think even without the copy card, it would have been fine. I think I could have struggled through, but like yeah. Endless scales really fast. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. You can still lock stuff in endless. Also challenges in front too. Nice. Well, let's copy that you'd win. I think it would have been fine. It did give me 3x. It gave me another 3x, which is pretty huge. But There's an achievement for 1 million points in one hand. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> what the fuck? You would have to start to get some... You'd have to start off getting some crazy, like, scaling. Start with crystal ball, voucher, one super slot, and two copies of the fool. Oh, right, okay. Uh, Tetsu packs always contain the planet card you most played. Poker hand, minus one consumable slot. That's kind of nice. Yeah. Just again, sure you will like uh, scale your deck or your, your, the hand you want to play. Special cards may appear in the shop. Start with the hex card. Add polychrome to a random joker. Destroy all the jokers. Right. Start from with no face cards in your deck. Yeah, this is where they get like special, like uh, out here, because now they get like fucking scuffed. No face cards, huh? Will this will, will this just be a smaller deck then? Oh, nice. Forty card deck. That sounds fun. The walkie-talkie deck, yeah, for real, <laughs> actually. This this would be the good deck to play the walkie-talkie with. Huh. Works well with bus? Oh yeah, for sure. All the events, yeah, it has some strength. There's a lot of things that scales with face cards, though, and so that's like a bit annoying, but... If you're willing to go to the mega pain of the higher difficulties, the decks are very fun. Yeah, I can imagine. I think I'm gonna call it today here though, because I have uh, a lecture tomorrow. Tomorrow, by the way, tomorrow is the last lecture I'm doing. That's the final one. After that, I'm done. And then we're back to like the usual grind where I like actually have uh, time to breathe during the day. Um, because now I can now I like, literally dude, I wake up early. I, I said this like a million times. I wake up early, I go straight to that job, have lecture for like f five hours, and then I, I work out. I come home, I fucking sleep because I'm dead, and then I get, start streaming, it's just like, it's so much. What are you lecturing about? I guess I could tell you again. Uh, again, for the million time, <laughs> sorry. Um, I have been hired in by like the local, uh, I don't know, it's like some culture initiative by the government, run by some other people. Really great stuff. Um, they have like, so many like, uh, things for, for like young people to do. They got like, uh, uh, they host game tournaments, they host like, uh, they have like equipment for making videos, or, like movies and shit, like if you're into the creative stuff. Uh, they got 3D printing and, and all this like fun stuff you can do, with, like around technology and just like making arts um, for, for like youth. Uh, they, they do so much cool shit. And they wanted me to hold like, cause they, they have been doing lectures about streaming and stuff and they were like, well, you're a streamer. You do this for a living and you have for many years, so, like why don't you do the talk? And then I, I, I like, uh, said yes, and I modified the presentation a bit, because they already had one, but I had to modify it and, like, make it more like mine. Um, and then I, yeah, I just show up and, uh, I kind of just, like, talk about... But, but I, I, we're, we're two people, so the first it's, it's Crimson Cassius, he's in chat sometimes. He talks about the history of Twitch, that it started with, like, Justin TV, and then it was brought up by Amazon, and, like, that po Twitch plays Pokemon and Pokemon Go. Uh, because Pokemon is like a gigantic franchise, it's like the biggest franchise in the world, as far as I know. Uh, that has helped like elevated Twitch into the mainstream and made it bigger. Uh, just and so forth and so on, like how this all came to be um, in the beginning. And then after that, I have I have my part uh, after like lunch, where I talk about rigging in Isaac for five hours. Uh, 
<laughs> no, I'm talking about like uh, the the practical parts of like being a streamer and like uh, yeah, just 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 the, the the logistics of it, what you actually have to do. That that like you have to spread your content around. You have one of schedule and like talk. I talk about health as well. Like yeah, I I my entire life I've I've always been like active like physically, uh, and that like I have never had issues with it. But like again, if if you if you don't fail the physical fitness check or the mental well-being check as a streamer. The consequences are way more severe than if you have a regular job because you can't like call in sick. You don't get paid if you don't work. You lose relevancy if you don't stream. So if you get sick, you're fucked. Um, and then mental, mentally, like if you don't have a so like a close social like circle of people that you like get to talk to and socialize with, um, and like you don't have school, you don't have like because as a, as a, as a student you have you have an external thing taking out to to go out. The school is taking, making you go out of your house in the morning, socialize with people. You have social opportunities. You can make friends. You can, you can do so much, right? But just you get to talk to people. Um, in in the work, you have the same thing. You have lunch breaks. You have uh, like in in Christmas times, you have like uh, feasts. In uh, you, you might give, grab like a Friday beer if you have a job, right? Stuff like that. Just like social shit, team building stuff. Um, great shit. The second you become a streamer, you don't have that. You, you, when you become a streamer, you just don't have that shit. Uh, your Fredax pills, right? That's really nice, but you don't have it as a streamer. Uh, so you have to make it yourself. And if you don't have, if you haven't built up like a social network and you haven't like, you have built it up and maintained it and have close friends and all this stuff, if you don't have that, you're gonna be fucked. You're gonna go insane because you don't get socialized because there's nothing in the world making you get up in the morning and go out there in the world. Uh, you have to make the up that yourself. So that's like the, it's super important uh, for for like streamers, I guess, to just like don't like rot. Have most least favorite boss blind so far. My least favorite boss blind is the one that downgrades the hands you play. Fuck that blind. <laughs> it's actually so bad. I usually started streaming just because I I don't have said wait. <laughs> I don't have such social circle to begin with. Yeah, risky, but I guess like you can, you, like on the flip side though, like I am horrible at networking and I talk about this in, in, this, in the thing as well. Like I suck at networking for a lot of the time. Like I might meet, I might go to TwitchCon or some shit and I meet a streamer and he's like big or her. She's like big and like really popular. And it's in my best interest to, to like uh, just sweet talk this person essentially and become friends with them, right? Because I, that I'm friends with a big streamer. Awesome. However, I don't, if, if I meet someone and I think personally they're a fucking asswipe, I'm not gonna like socialize with them because I don't want to do that. Um, so I like, obviously I'm not gonna like, for me, per, I, I don't do that. Like I don't, I don't network too much. Um, but, but like that's a, that's that definitely is like a, a, a valid tool to use. Like a lot of people have built their career around just networking, uh, which, you know, to each their own. You're, you're like three steps away from making it big in the VTuber sphere. <laughs> yeah. But that's because, like, that's the thing. I, I call up with Tenma because I like Tenma. I think she's funny. I think we have good chemistry. And the streams we do are fun. We have fun together. Right? That's why I call up with Tenma. Um, she's also, like, coincidentally, or just like, uh, what's it called? Uh, conveniently, around the same, same size as me. So it's just, it just works. So that's that's like that's 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 great. But those those like collab opportunities where, where like I actually like doing it are so fucking rare though. Like <laughs> it's so many times where it's like, yeah, I just don't. I meet a YouTuber and I'm just like, eh, yeah, <laughs> whatever. Yeah, I meant viewership chat, not dick size. But yeah, like it was, uh, it was chill. Do you dislike the Matman? I didn't dislike Matman, but we did one collab and it was like that. That was that. If I didn't like, if I didn't like Matman, I wouldn't have collab with them. Like that's that's it. I usually, I usually don't like. I usually don't go into a collab with someone like that if I like don't think I'm gonna like. Like that's that's like yeah. Matman was fine. It was fun. It was it was fun playing with, with someone who was like also as like into Isaac as I am. What's what's your peak viewer count? 
Uh, I think the most I had on like without being like raided was like eighteen hundred probably. Eighteen hundred is like as far as high as I've gone. And that, I think that was like during. Uh, what the fuck would that be during? I ha I've had some like really hype streams, but I kind of forget them. <laughs> Not not even a streamer, but working from home, you also get less socializing and going out. Yeah, basically, yeah. Now, now, I guess, I guess nowadays, actually, that applies to more people because working from home uh, has become so normal after uh, after COVID. Like COVID fucking changed so much. But the thing is that like COVID made so many people miserable, but after, I didn't notice that it didn't make a fucking dent in my mental health for the most part because I had like social. I I was here in Tromsø. I have a social group here. And I work from home anyways, so I didn't care. Uh, but I do have hypochondria, so I don't like uh, diseases and stuff going around, so... There's that. You posted a vid saying you were live right now and views went wild. Oh, yeah, I did, right! I wonder when the fuck that was. I think it was like some... Uh... Yeah, I don't know. There was a video that said I was live, yeah, and, and the views went fucking nuts. It was so good. I rested home so well. You have no idea. Nice. Noita. Yeah, it's probably Noita. Baldur's Gate average was 600. Yeah. But dude, there are some games I just, I'm not allowed to play on stream. Baldur's Gate, I'm not allowed to play on stream. Talos Principle, I'm not allowed to play on stream. Uh, there's, there's, there's a few games that are just like so fucking boring, apparently, that I'm just not allowed to play them. Wait, you're in Tromsø? I was there a week ago. Finland, by the way. That's a lie. I have not seen a single Finnish person in Tromsø in my entire life. I've I've heard so many languages here. In Tromsø, you go out in the streets, you hear Spanish, you hear Chinese. There's so many Chinese people. Holy fuck. It's Chinatown out there. You hear Japanese, you hear German, you hear every world, every, every country in the... You probably hear, like, fucking African. You hear, like, uh, South Korean. Before, you hear Finnish. There is no Finnish people here. I don't believe it. Not gonna happen. Want me to prove you wrong? I'll be there again in a month to meet you, my friend. <laughs> I don't know. You're not finished, then. You're Swedish. What? It says so many people that come to Tromsø. Yeah, it's been, this, this place. I'm telling you guys, Tromsø is the big new epic thing. P uh, I swear, like Chinese people love this place. I I, I go to like a fishing house to buy sushi because I like having sushi on Fridays because I'm a spoiled little dog. But, I do that, and the place is, like, it's, it's, it's like a little hub with a bunch of restaurants, and there's not a single, like, Norwegian person there. No, like, it's it's gotten so international in my city that, like, the, when I go out to eat, and I want to buy something, right, I want to get, like, a pizza or something, like, a restaurant, they, they don't speak Norwegian. <laughs> they speak English. It's like, I don't mind, because I, like... For example, one time during the the lectures, that we had like an interna like Tromsø International School, and they don't speak they speak some Norwegian, but they're like learning, right? So I had to do it in English, and it went better because I'm better at speaking in English than I am in Norwegian. Like so, that's, that's when I realized that like, damn, I wish I could do all of these in English because my English is literally better than my fucking Norwegian. But yeah, it it, it, it was it was a revelation. <laughs> It was actually a revelation, but then, uh, yeah, uh, there, there's like, yeah, the city has become very international, and tourism here is like fucking booming. You have no, f I have to take a picture and show it to you guys sometime. I should do it because I go back back and forth in the city all the time because I live in it, and there's a little kiosk, a little, my god, kiosk, like a little dildo in the middle of the city, uh, super small, and they sell sausages. Look at this. Here it is. Here's this little kiosk in the middle of the city. This, that's it. This little bar, quote unquote, little dildo in the middle of town square uh, is sells sausages. And this line here is so full of tourists every time I go. It's like a, it's literally like a 50 meter line of tourists. They want to buy a sausage from this little scat. It's super expensive too. This sausage is probably like fucking $6. And it's super, like, there, there is a 7-Eleven, like, five meters off off the camera, where you can just buy a fucking sausage with no line, and it tastes the same. 
Like there, there's no, there's no difference. But every, every tourist like just loves to come here and just like suck on the sauce. Just for some reason, it does. It's fine. Like I don't. It's not prohibiting me from buying from the kiosk because I never fucking do it. But it's just so weird to me that like everyone just loves that kiosk for some reason. You're favoring a 7-Eleven or a local business? Yes, I am! When the line of the local business is fucking 20 minutes, then I kind of favor the zero minute wait time over that. Yeah, guilty as charged. It's fine if the local business fucking sucks. Then I'm, I'm cool with it. Any Serbians? I have no idea. It's not like the local business is going bankrupt. Yeah, they, they have an issue of selling too much. It's like, I, I, it's inconvenience to buy. It's inconvenience for me to buy there because they're selling too much, and it's like, oh, you're. It's the local business you're supposed to support. It's like, fuck no. Suffering from success. Any Italians? Uh, yes, we have Italians here too. Italians. Like all of Middle, Middle Europe, Europe, I guess. Like a lot of, but it's changed a lot over the years. Like before, it was just uh, some uh, the occasional German, but now it's like it's so much. But fine. Why is it roasting Rakatsios can? <laughs> I'm not roasting Rakatsios. I I am not roasting that. I'm roasting the f the five Gorillian tourists going in a line. To buy an, an overpriced sausage when there is a mix, a 7-Eleven, like so many places around that sells the exact same thing for like slightly less money. And you don't have to stand in a line outside in the cold for 20 minutes to get your fucking sausage. That's why, that's why, that, that's what I'm roasting. My bad son, thought you were planning on moving to Trom from Tromsø. No, I'm not, I'm not, well I am planning to moving. <laughs> I am. I'm planning to move to Oslo. Because I want to uh, live in Oslo. <laughs> Oslo maxing. No, Oslo is chill. I have a lot of family and, and, and fam family and like friends there. Uh, and uh, yeah, it's, it's, and I've lived there before. And it's like, there's a lot of concerts there. There's a lot of, there's a lot of shit going on basically all the time. And Tinder in Oslo is fucking crazy. <laughs> I, I went on Tinder in Oslo for, for like two days and within those two days there were like at least three girls who looked like their dad beat them at home. It was so epic. <laughs> Best Tinder experience of my life. Uh, how far are you? How are you doing Albino? Is everything alright? Uh, how is your mental health? I hope you're doing alright. Much love. Thank you dead chick bed. I'm doing great. The national day is also dope in Oslo. True, it's dope here too, but it's a bit warmer down there. <laughs> yep. Yeah, no. I mean, Tinder is shit, but it's just like funny to to do to do to bits about it, to joke about it. Oslo is uh, Oslo is like kind of a it's like partially Scandinavian city and partially shithole. There's so many crackheads in Oslo, like, holy fuck, man. You, like, walk in a park and step on a fucking syringe. <laughs> Get, uh, one stat down and two stats up. I live in the Finnish armpit Olo. I went, to, I used to go to Olo for, like, a summer vacation. Like, with my dad. My, my dad couldn't afford, like, a, 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 like, expensive, like, plane vacation. So we used to drive from Tromsø to Olo, uh, and we went to Olo camping, in like those moist fucking shit cabins. <laughs> There's like a, a camping site full of fucking sheds that are like moisty and moldy, uh, and we just like chilled there with like a fucking a bunch of like bugs in the bed. Uh, and it, but it was fun. It was fun. I, I had no standards, and my, neither did my dad or my sisters. And it was always so funny because like we had a little, like a little tin can of a car that cost like one grand. Like a little scat on four wheels. And then my my dad's brother, they have like a Skoda Skoda Octavia, 
with air condition and uh, like like uh, this is this is a nice car. Um, and they when we came when we arrived in Oslo, like the we were like so hot because it was like we were sitting in like a fucking yeah a little tin can in the sun. And we couldn't we couldn't open the windows because we were driving so fast that if you open a window the car is so fucking light that it would just like <laughs> my dad would like low-key lose control over it. So we had to have the windows closed in the sun in the fucking tin can all the way for ten hours to Olo. And then uh yeah, we were like fucking sweaty coming out of that thing. And then my my, my like my uh, my cousins coming out of my, my uncle's car, they were just like like freezing cold. It was so uh, it was so sad. You told this before? Yeah, I think I told this before like one time, like a year ago. Most likely. I don't think I told that very recently. I do repeat myself like once a year I, I, at least. Because like... I think I'm misunderstanding a lot of people have it about... Well, it's, it's super obvious, but like it seems like people think that... If you have a thousand viewers, that... It's like a thousand the same people at the start of the stream as at the end of the stream. Whereas in reality... Very few people, I think, watch the stream from start to finish, and during that time, it kind of like circulates. New people come, new people go, and, and stuff like that. So, a, a lot of people just haven't heard when I've told those things because it's never been uploaded, or like on on YouTube or anything like that. Watched all of it. <laughs> nice. We were here. How high is rent in Oslo? How does this compare to your location? Not by much. It's basically the same. Like, Tromsø is really expensive, that's the thing. Here it's fucking expensive. In the middle of nowhere, well, it's actually is kind of a big city now, but... Oh, at the end of the world, in like the polar circle, like... It's su surprisingly, like, a lot of people want to live here. Void Watchers. <laughs> Renton Oslo is, is uh, probably comparable to here. Maybe a little bit more expensive. I lived in the middle of nowhere outside of Tromsø for a while and it made me depressed because no sun. Yeah, like I think, uh, dude, if you're gonna if you're gonna live in Tromsø and then you're gonna live like out in the boonies in Tromsø, at, at that point, you need you need to be someone who enjoys skiing, has a dog, uh, and l enjoy mountain hiking. If you don't like those three things and you live out outside of the city, in up here, then you are gonna be miserable. You told us a story in the IRL stream when you were going around in your neighborhood. Okay, nice. When you will play Voices of, the, Voices of the Void, I really like that game. Uh, well, I finished Shipwreck today, and I try to... I, I typically only do one horror game per stream, because I don't want to be, like, super tense the entire time. Like, if I play, like, two or three hours of Shipwreck, with, like, jump scares and spooky shit all the time, I'm going to be, like, a corpse if I keep playing horror games. I'm just going to be, like, dead. Uh, so if I play... Uh, yeah, if I play a horror game, I, I, I usually keep it to one per stream. And tomorrow we're playing Final Fantasy Freddy's again. <laughs> We're playing FNAF, uh, which is gonna be epic. Combine Cat, thank you for the sub. Oral thoughts on Shipwrecked? Uh, I, I really like it. Uh, the, the jump scares towards the end were kind of like... I guess you get an, you get like used to them anyway, so it's not that big of a deal. They are a bit like... Yeah, they, they do get annoying. Uh, but overall, I really, really like the game. Um... I didn't realize that the game was very straightforward with what was a secret and what was not, right? So, like, uh, sure, it had some red herrings, but it's not like uh, like Void Stranger, where, like, the game seemingly doesn't want you to realize that there's puzzles, and you kind of have to look for them. Whereas in, uh, in Shipwreck, the, the puzzles are, like, in front of your face. They're right there, and they're difficult, and they use, uh, like, uh, methods that are inconventional. Incon so like they aren't conventional. Like you have to like look at a YouTube URL. You gotta Google something. You gotta like look th like stuff like that. It's just it's just a very it's like a thinking outside a box situation instead of being like a mystery. What is the puzzle? Because it's it's unconventional. Yeah, they use a very unconventional means to to do the puzzles, which is really cool. And then there's the spooky factor and like the unsettling uh, Nintendo 64 game thing. I I liked it a lot. It was fun. It was, it was good. And I, 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 I do... Now I do like horror games. I, I like them. For somehow. I just... I, yeah, they're good stream content and they're funny. So, like, fuck it. We're gonna be, we're gonna be seeing more of those. 
Anyways, uh, I'm going to call it a day here and go to bed. I have, I'm really hungry, I need to eat, and I need to go to bed because I have to wake up early tomorrow for more lectures. The last lecture of all. Then I'm done. And then I'm gonna, like, just... I'm just gonna sleep, man. I'm just gonna sleep a lot. Finish this binocular one would be easy for you now, I think. Okay, okay. T tempo, tempo, tempo. I love you, but you're spamming. So even though I'm in, in the stream, I'm giving you 10 minutes just to, to think about what you've done. <laughs> it's just a, it's just a grudge. It's a grudge timeout. It's a, gr a grief, a grief. Anyways, yeah. Uh, thank you for watching. Thank you for the subs. Thank you for the bits. Thank you for the bonus. It's a bit fun. Uh, Shipwrecked, good. But out through good. Tomorrow we play FNAF, Fredbear, Fast Blast. And then uh, after that, I don't know what I'm going to be playing. But maybe Signalis. Oh yeah, we can do FNAF and Signalis. Peak Kino stream. Good idea. Epic. Anyways. Yeah, good night. Bye-bye.